Asking am I alright? As if I was precious or in my pine. I'll find the answer or a good night. Thank God the time is short. And yes, you always do that one thing. When you wrinkle up the nose bridge. I'm trying to figure out what that meant. I took it as a tour. Remember when back then in school? Breaks unstable. And don't you think that we can all tell? You're insecure, you're insecure. I guess I always do that one thing. When I get too drunk and jump in, figure out what makes your brain tick. I'm a listener. At the front door, you claim to try to touch the cat door. Thank God the time is short. And yes, you always do that one thing. Cause when you throw and trash me under, yeah, I'm dripping. I'm trying to figure out what that means. I took it as a taunt. Hi, internet people! How are you doing? Oh my gosh, my voice is like... I just like honked there, oh my goodness! 
I see so many people in- Mora! Why? <laughs> oh my gosh, I see so many people in chat already. Oh, thank you! I love you too, Pengu. Uh, hi, item. I didn't even have to look at your name again. Oh my gosh, I see Pengu got first today. Thank you so much for redeeming M attendance, Pengu. Unstoppable Sammy, thank you for redeeming M attendance. Thank you, thank you. I see, who else do I see here? I see Pengu, I see Sammy, I see Mora, of course, and Item. Oh my gosh, you guys are awesome. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Whoop. I'm doing finger hearts. You can't see, I'm doing finger heart. All right, so we are gonna get in and play Genshin Impact again today. Oh my gosh, hi Dari! Yeah, oh, you can see, I did. I finally did a stream timer for subs because I don't like selling out verbally, so I just am getting a, a bot to do it for me. <laughs> Yay! So there it is, there it is. Oh my goodness, guys, I've been having so much fun lately. I've been having so much fun these past couple days. I've still been like super busy and I'm really excited to get to a point where I am not busy anymore. Oh, oh James. I need to apologize. I need to apologize. I don't- I don't know. Chicken attack. I've been busy today. I've been busy today. So I'm gonna- what did I do? What did I just do? Did my computer just- no it didn't. Never mind. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and- and- and just- and just get rid of that one for now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, James. I'm sorry. You can choose another song if you want. Oh my gosh. My, my limited music taste is, is once again, is once again showing itself. It's every day at this point. It's every day at this point. Oh my goodness. All right. Slasher in. Hello. Welcome. Welcome. I see you're in chat. Oh my gosh. And Stroobkoob says hello as well. Stroobkoob probably said hello before I did. <laughs> oh my gosh. Stroobkoob was really cool. Do chicken attack? I will have to. I will have to. The problem is that the melody there is a little more complicated. I could probably fake my way through it, except that the melody is a lot more complicated uh, than most songs. Than most songs. Oh my gosh. And so yeah, thank you for the Doritos item. So I'm gonna, in just a moment, open up, open up, um, oh, what is it? Genshin. There we go. But first, before I actually get into it, I wanted to quickly show you guys, you know, at the bottom of stream, Yes, Discord is right there. Thank you. Thank you, Pangu. Um, yeah, at the bottom of the stream, you guys have got, you can see the VTuber um, thing has been achieved. So I will be doing the VTuber. I will start doing that in October. It's not quite done. So um, that'll that's that's a thing that'll happen. That's a thing that'll happen. October is really, really cool. But uh, I want to see how far we can go with subs between now and October. I think it's like if we don't, um, it's like, because you guys, you guys got to the 20. The, the goal has been reached. But I want to just kind of see how far we can go. I feel like, how about this? If we get to 30, you can hear someone hammering downstairs. I know you can. Okay. If we get to 30, how about this? I will also have, I will also have emotes for you guys. Does that work? Does that work? Do you, would you guys like emotes as well as a VTuber? Just some, just some new ones. I've been working on them. Ooh, okay, yeah, Pengu, I love that, I love that. Oh my gosh, yeah. Okay, so, hi Patch, hello! Alright, so yeah, we will we will have the VTuber, and if we reach 30, we will also have new emotes. You can see the old ones right there, people are putting them in chat. People haven't been using the emotes as much lately, but you know what, that's fine. We'll find some good ones, we'll find some good ones for you guys. Oh, what else? There was another thing. Yeah, October's gonna be a fun month, guys. October's gonna be a fun month. Have you seen the secret project at the bottom of the Discord? Uh, a couple people mentioned that, so I just wanted to address it. You guys are meant to see the, the thing there, but you're not meant to know what the secret project is. There is actually two. One of them I will be announcing early October, and it's going to be super, super, super fun. I cannot wait for you guys to hear about it and see it. It's going to be amazing, guys. It's going to be amazing. Spooky month? Yes, October. <laughs> okay. Uh, excuse me. I am going to quickly... Oh, dang. I don't want to close in the middle of the song. I don't want to close in the middle of the song. Oh, my gosh gonna be amazing amazing yes emma is live troll welcome 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 stroop Koob is is greeting people for me sometimes oh my gosh guys it's awesome i'm so proud of myself too i remembered to change my stream title i am so happy okay okay <laughs> oh my gosh all right um so what else can I do? What can I say? What else can I talk about? Just to like run down the clock because I don't want to leave this song. I love this song so much. Oh, it's so cool. It's so cool. Oh my gosh. Um. Yes, yeah, Stroob Koob is being is being a good bird. He's being a good bird. He's adorable. Oh my gosh. Um. So yeah, what else can I talk about? I'm just trying to think of something. Just trying to think of something. 
Ooh, one little thing, one little thing. I will be uploading more on TikTok. It's like, I've been busy lately. It's like, that's, I'm learning some really cool things about just the way TikTok operates. It seems to be, it's like one to two videos a day if you want to grow, but you have to post like three, sorry, one to two videos a day to like maintain things, but you need to post like three or four a day to really grow. It's it's kind of cool. So I haven't been growing as much on TikTok lately, I would, but then again, I did get like 5,000 in a week and that was really crazy. That was crazy. Um, but yeah, I will be getting back to my normal my normal upload schedule on TikTok very, very soon. But like I said, I've been busy. It's awesome. It's awesome. Okay, I think we're 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 far enough into the song now that we can we can we can switch it off. It is to find someone like you. Only comes along once in a blue. How hard it is to stay away from you. Once in a Oh my gosh, Pangu, you scared me. You scared me. Okay. Pause song. Pause song. And three, two, two, two. FBI, open up! Nice. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I forgot. I, I accidentally, um, there was an internet issue last night when I was playing, so. Um. Now, which password did I use for this? I forget. I forget which password. I have like four passwords that I use for different things. Oh, it was a password error, of course. Who is that? James! Welcome. Welcome, James. La, da, da. There we go. Okay. Now, as always, it's going to be awkward for just like two seconds, and then boom, boom. Why is someone hammering? downstairs I don't know I don't know oh, okay this little thing needs to go that little black square needs to go right now um, because that is a video capture okay okay that is a this that's that's a video capture <laughs> to the camera that is currently on but covered at the top of my screen if I were to bump that and the lens would pop off and the, the lens cover would pop off, you guys would totally get a face reveal and I don't want to do that yet. <laughs> I don't want to do that yet. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Not yet. The little the little leg there. Boop. Let's go let's enter the door, guys. Let's enter the door. So I've done some off off screen, of course, off screen grinding, off stream grinding. I'm going to show you the map and show you exactly what I did, exactly what I did. I, yes, I'm sure you guys would. I'm sure you guys would. I would, I would unpublish that specific part of the VOD. Ooh. <laughs> uh, thanks, Starry. It's a cute sound, okay? It's a cute sound. I hate that there's such a, like a, like a specific thing around it because it's adorable. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hi, Amber. Hello, Amber. Okay, so let's quickly go up here. I haven't been on today. I haven't been on today. What is this? Should we do some ley line stuff? Should we do some ley line stuff? It all adds up to beating the game. Yeah. Let me see. So I've been, I have been leveling people up. I've been doing fun stuff. Let me see characters. I have now decided that Razor, because I got Razor, guys. I got Razor. Uh, yeah, I don't think that happened um, before before the last time I streamed this. So that's he's gonna be my 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 fourth for a little while. He's gonna be my um, what do you call it? My Electro wielder, because I dislike Lisa strongly. And then, of course, Noelle is in reserve. We've got Chong Yun, and we've got, um, I want to eventually level up Bennett because the only, adventure team, assemble. the only fire wielder I have, the only pyro wielder, um, that I have is an archer. Oh, and she's wow. awesome. 
What is that? She's awesome. But also, she is limited because the bow is her weapon. And so I want to be able to do some melee stuff. Lisa is a bad character. Lisa is way too flirtatious with children. Um, and so we, we strongly... We, we dislike that. We dislike that. We don't want anything to do with that. Nothing. Nothing to do with that. I, by the way, I went back and um, listened to, like, the clip. Thank you for the lurk, thank you. Um, surrounding the other character that I, that I, um, what is her name? Uh, Yinger in, 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 what's her name, Liwei? Yeah, Yinger and Liwei. I went through the, that clip before, sorry. I went through the clip after stream and I looked through it. I actually did it earlier today. And there were some lines that I missed because I was talking to you guys. There was like specific things that she was saying that I didn't actually notice that were even worse. And so, yeah, I'm... Ugh. Ugh. Hey, yo. Let's see. Is there anything more to this? Um, going to Dragon Spine. I think I already accepted this quest. But this is not the quest that we're doing right now. I'm going to go back to Leeway and do some stuff. Um. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Wait, we get a pocket watch from that kid? What pocket watch should we get? Adventurer's pocket watch. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, kid, but I'm probably just gonna end up adding it to my other stuff. Look at this. Oh, uh, wait a second. No, that, that's not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. So, guys, these are my weapons. I, I, I love my weapons. I've got so many of these. They're so cool. And then I've got my, my, my artifacts. My artifacts is the one he just gave me. I've been trying to level up as many of these as I can. I love, I love these so much. I give the exile, uh, set. By the way, when what? Wait, 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 okay, just a second. When will I lower text to speech? I forgot about that. I, okay, thanks for reminding me. I'm gonna give myself a note. I'll do it after stream, I think. Um, or at some point. Who is she? Who is she? Let me see what you're saying. Ah, got it. Understood. Understood. Okay, you know what? I will take care of that. I have to just, just, it's for now, just, sorry. I'm gonna deal with it, but, um... <laughs> What was it that I need to do? Okay, firstly, health. We have a health issue currently. My health bar at the bottom of the screen is way too low because I was fighting things. Hey, yo. I'd like a little something, please. Please. Do it now, text to speech? Nah. Nah. Okay, I can't do any of that because. Unless there's a way to make it so that I'm only doing. So that I'm only, um. Oh, what do you call it? Oh! Hello, there's things going on in Mondstadt. Why, where, buttons? Which button? There we go. Oh, yeah, here's here's the thing I want to show you guys. 100% completion in Brett Car Mountains. 97% completion in Starfell Valley. 91% completion in Gale Song Hill. Someone's knocking at my door, just a second. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Dang. Alright, so yeah, I've got a ton of stuff here that I've been doing. What's my progress in Dra Dragon Spine? 27%. Dragon Spine is difficult to maneuver because it's so cold and you got to really plan out exactly where you got to be, where you're going to go. So let's go to the waypoint here. Time out, James. <laughs> okay. Um. I don't, I, I don't, okay. I made that a thing. Let me see. I don't know why you're doing this to James, but okay. 
Um... Here we go. <laughs> You're only timed out for two minutes, James, don't worry. Um... Transfers of supplies must be... Here we go. Uh, what is it that I need to get here? How's my reputation in Mondstadt? Show me the things. Mondstadt quest. Land entombed. That's right. I did another thing after I came here. Oh my gosh. Look at this. My reputation is going up. I've got so many things that I still need to do, though. So many things. Mondstadt and its Archon. Things that I- there's things that I can't do yet. Um, 88% world exploration. This is so cool. Wait, for five minutes? Does it? Oh no. Here, I'll wait till it to run out and then I'll, I'll do it for another three. Just cuts. Alright, uh, let's go over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, uh, Ludmila. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Swindly. Wow. Hmm. It has become my habit to go straight to mint jelly when I have to, uh, get health for my characters. Don't know why. But I enjoy this recipe. Plus, sugar and, um, mint are both, like, some of the most readily available resources in the game. So, I always seem... I always seem to, to have a, uh, an overabundance of both mint and the, the sweet flowers that the sugar is made from. Hello there. General Kenobi. Thank you, Mrs. Stonks. Miss Stonks? MS Stonks? <laughs> I'm not sure what it is supposed to be. Okay. Let me see, how many do I have? I have 13 right now. I can make eight more. I'm gonna I'm gonna mm, confirm. At some point time becomes a thing. Alright. Hello. Hello. Wait, what else do I need currently? Expedition reward and adventure rank rewards. That's right! I got adventure rank last night. Miss Stonks got it. Add Astro Abyssosk. Add Astro Abyssosk. Welcome Abisosk. to the Adventurous Guild. <laughs> okay, claim adventure rank rewards. Because I leveled up last night. Oh no, sorry, Catherine. Add Astra Abyssosk. Welcome to the Adventurous Guild. Okay, so we've got... We're gonna get Chong Yun. And she is still there, so we're just gonna send Chong Yun out, Chong Yun out again. <laughs> Okay. New reputation quest. Um. Oh, bounties are available. Well, I have been failing at bounties spectacularly lately. I'm not sure why. So I'll have to do some research. It's fine. <laughs> there we go. And that works wonderfully. Wonderfully. Okay, so let me. I'm now gonna check the journal because I want to continue the story. I want to continue the story always. Um, downtown. We're gonna get thirty. Oh my gosh. So let's go, and let's go to Liyue. <laughs> Sorry, I'm eating. <laughs> Trying to be as quiet as possible. Um, oh, I need to buy kites. Yeah, that was the thing we left off on. Ah, sir, you're here. The seven kites you asked for mm -hmm. have been made to order. Would you like to take them now? <laughs> thank you, Granny Shannon. Yes, thank you. 
It's rare to see customers who want to buy this type of kite nowadays. Really? In the early so days, the the we kite? used to get orders from people of all walks of life. Well, this is Mr. Zhang Li from the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. So he's probably well versed in all these walks of life. Yeah, he seems very learned. I kind of like Zhang Li. He's cool. He's cool. <clears throat> Except for his uh, persistent habit of leaving his wallet at home and forcing me to pay for everything. <laughs> We've talked about a whole bunch of things. This is true. This is true, Troll. Mm hmm. Tea, perfumes, flora, he fauna. He seems to know Liu is favorite topics, money and government, really well. But he likes talking I'll fix about less useful topics instead. <laughs> well, that's because I prefer to share fun things with you. Well, thanks for that. <laughs> Children's toys are very fun things, that's for sure. I enjoy watching the children at play as much as anyone else. Mm -hmm. But there is more to it than that. Oh, tell us, Granny. I want to learn more about the Finely way. crafted toys are well loved by children, but this craft itself has been honed over thousands of years, mm -hmm. and there is meaning behind that. Mm -hmm. I have made kites in Liyue for 40 years, and I am intimately familiar with the forms passed down from my ancestors. The meaning of these seven kites is far from banal. Oh, tell us. I want to learn. Indeed. Yay! These are Jolly decorations knows, used in the rite of parting. The seven kites represent the seven. Oh, that makes sense. I took the liberty of coloring outside the lines when doing the insignia of the Animo Archon. Mm -hmm. As for the kite that honors the Geo Archon, one must follow the contract given right down to the last letter. Wow. These patterns are ancient, and you can also find them in the Golden House. This is so interesting. Okay, I love games that have like the 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 like the the super fleshed out world building. This is wonderful. Ah, Paimon's heard that name before. Mm-hmm. The design of this kite displays a firm <laughs> grasp on the cyclicality and eternity so dear to the Electro Archon. It's so cool. These markings of tree and leaf pay due honor to wisdom and the passage of time. All this on a single kite. Truly astonishing. Granny Shan seems to be a master of her Justice craft. flows across the surface of the waters. War rages like a flame. As does that which the Cryo Archon once... <sighs> mm -hmm. Yes, these details are masterfully done. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> I wish we could see the, the kites. Come on. A learned man truly are pleasant. Hopefully, if like if they're in our inventory, I'll take a closer look at them. Well then, Granny Shen, I shall take these back with me. As for the payment. As for the well, payment, he me. says. Child, hi, child. Thank you. You're just in time. Hey, it's child. <laughs> no, I was merely passing through. Well, that's helpful. I'd rather not pay for, for Zhongli's slip-ups anymore. Mr. Zhongli's the same as ever. When paying, well, when getting others to pay for him, he neither looks at the price tag nor his wallet. Oh my gosh, I see you're familiar with the man. He knows a great deal about money, and about the trials of the common man. He just doesn't consider poverty to be something that could ever happen to him. <laughs> well, he seems to be avoiding it pretty well so far. Child is paying for the child's toy. <laughs> oh, wait a second. Child. Guys, it's Tommy. He's even got the red and white motif going. And the blonde hair and blue eyes. It's Tommy, guys. <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's 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 a clip. Or um, perhaps <laughs> you could say that he cannot imagine himself the lacking money. Oh my gosh. How has he not died of hunger yet? Child, you are as fond of jokes as ever. Well then, <laughs> since we've purchased our kites without incident, there's no need to take a break before moving to the next step in our preparations. Are we moving towards the final step? The rite of parting requires helping hands as well as materials. We should be able to find some people near the harbor. Yeah. Oh, by the way, take this bag of money. You probably won't want to let Zhang Li do the bargaining, if you know what I mean. 
Yeah, he's a little too generous hmm. with Seems other I missed people's out on money. Some interesting information. Hey, Taco, welcome. I suppose I'll just have to find a more opportune moment next time. Hmm. See, okay, here. I like Child, but I also really don't trust him. I really do not trust him. Oh yeah, I want to talk to Manager Quan. Hi, because he was part of a thing last time. Hi. It's something that I did off, um, off, off stream. Yes, off stream last night, and I, I couldn't do anything with it until he was until I was finished with part of the story. Oh. Thank you. Oh, poor guy. Yay! I've got three! I've got three of the hero's stuff. I've got three of the hero's stuff. Wait, let me see. Let's go down here. Let me see. Who do I need to talk to? Uncle Sam? Uncle Gao? Or is there someone down? <gasps> Toe! Toe! Let me talk to you, please. Let me talk to you. Sure. But let me just he say no that I'm a reserve member of the Adventurer's Guild. I take adventuring commissions, but I don't do anything clerical. Okay, thanks. Adventure. Good to know. But venturing into the mountains to capture a few crystal flies seems adventurous enough. Eh? That's not hard. Almost a bit too easy for a reserve adventurer. Nah, never mind. I'll only charge you fifteen thousand mora. What say you? Um, that's a lot of mora. A most fair price. Excuse me. Here. Um. Let's let's go down to to twelve thousand. Five geo crystal flies. Yes, I do think it's worth about Yay. this much. I'll do it. Yay! Okay, we've got one. Anyone up here? Hello? Hey, Tuck! Wait, if the first person's name is Tick, I am going to... Oh my gosh. Tick, tack, toe. A full day of odd jobs at Eugene Terrace. Hmm. No problem. 25000 per day. A fair trade, uh... yes? Whoa, that's expensive. Um, could you give us a yeah, bit that, of a that'd discount be nice. on account of the whole hero of Mondstadt thing? Uh, I highly doubt that he's going to care what happens in Mondstadt. This is Liyue. Hero of Mondstadt? Never heard of them. Uh, well, yeah. you may never have heard of this hero, but it seems you've heard of Mora nonetheless. Thus, I will simply pay the whole sum. Oh my gosh. I'm I'm trying to just drop it down just just a little bit. Just just enough. Not not too much, but enough that it's it's fair. There we go. Hey, that's a good price. Anyone would work for this much Mora. Nice. Okay, good. Okay, we got one more person, hopefully. Hopefully. We don't need any more. Yep, tick, tack, and toe. Oh, help? Sure. I, Tick, always put in 100% effort into everything I do. Oh, thanks. That's good of to course. know. Of course. So what's the job? Mm-hmm. I don't even know Let what needs to be see. done. We are still missing some wooden implements over at Eugene Terrace. They aren't uncommon objects, so I didn't make any special preparations for them. No problem. That'll be 20,000 mora for a single no. trip. How does that sound? Done. No. Uh. This is all you got? A child? Uh, no, no, no. He's putting up the money? How about okay, this? Okay, this is, this is, Let's I understand. Let's make a trade. I'll take what you're offering right now, and... What else do you need? Get me a single chinkson flower, oh, and I'll consider that payment for a detour to find this child fellow. Guess we've got no choice. Yeah, I've got plenty of chinkson flowers. So, uh, let me just... Talk to Tick again. Have you brought the goods? Hey, yes. That's pretty good. These things are pretty rare, and I have no idea where I'd find them. Well, I'm an adventurer, so I come across them lying around flower, quite a bit. I should be able to pacify my daughter tonight. Oh my gosh. I'll make sure the work is done before I return home. All right, there we go. There we go. Let's go talk to Child. 
Dang, I love this game. It's so beautiful. There he is. Hello, child. Let's do a All thing. Finished, then? Yeah. Splendid. Any leftover cash is yours to keep. A favor for the Fatui should never go unrewarded. Well, thanks, but we kind of uh, ran out of cash. Do you think you can buy us off with some loose change? What loose change? No way. Paimon demands to know when the next payment is coming. Paimon, just <laughs> shush. Well, how does this sound? You give me the information I need, and maybe I'll leave the Northland Bank's vaults open and unattended for half an hour. Uh, this is very chaotic of you, sir. Um, while I appreciate it, I'm not a thief. Um, what info do you need? Paimon, no. Huh. Does that mean you know what he's after? My gosh. Yikes! You're right, Signora! <laughs> you both need to calm down. I don't know what's gotten into you. I think you do, but also, I would love... I would love a little more, uh, security in this, in this trade-off. If I can give you information, can you just, like... See, you leaving the vaults unattended is no guarantee that I'm even gonna get what I'm coming for. Just what is this about? The atmosphere got so tense all of a sudden. Uh, we've dealt with a Geo Archon going bad. Wait, with an Archon going bad or having issues before. <laughs> Hi, Mon. You little... Next, we need some everlasting <sighs> For such a small creature, For this, we need you to have go to such Boo -Boo a huge pharmacy, mouth on you. The finest pharmacy in all of... Is... Everything okay? Nope. Everything is fine. I was just informing them that they need not return the surplus mora. What surplus now, if you'll mora? excuse me, I must be going. Simon definitely felt Ooh. like Child wasn't happy with us just now. No, he was not. He was very not. All right, so uh, let's go to Boo Boo Pharmacy to get the things that we need. We are very close. Yeet. Uh. Yeet. Have I talked to them over here at all? I don't know. Oh, wait, they're on the other side of the garden? Then I haven't talked to them. Was a mistake. Hey, yo! The end of the Leeway. Oh, wow. Okay. Huh. The reception is deserted. And it seems kind of spooky in here. I mean, I talked to the pharmacist earlier. Hello? Is anybody there? Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. Where is that voice coming from? And where are you, sir? Huh? Ma'am? Huh? Did you hear that? Where did it come from? Are you in the ceiling or behind the, the desk? The reception, it seems. How about you go check it out, and Paimon will bring up the rear. When do you do anything else, Paimon? Neat. Show me. Tiny person. Is this a child? Oh, there or just you are. small. But you can't even reach the counter. Jokes on you. <laughs> Paimon floats, so height is no restriction. I mean, still, but don't make fun anyway, of people's height. There's something weird about this one over here. What's the talisman doing on her forehead? I don't know what's going on here. They're obviously a cryo wielder. It can't be. She's. A zombie? Huh? Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. I am Chi Chi. Chi Chi the zombie. Once upon a time, Chi Chi died. Then, Chi Chi was saved what? by the Adepti. Now, Chi Chi is a zombie. 
funny I don't understand, but okay. In Mondstadt. Yeah, Leeway seems a bit strange, but I'm not complaining. Uh, hello, little girl. Do you sell everlasting incense here? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Did you bring your prescription? I... She's so cute, though, okay? She's Surely so cute. Surely no prescription is needed to purchase everlasting incense. It's not a controlled substance. Chi-Chi can get your medicine, but only if you show Chi-Chi your prescription. These are Chi-Chi's orders from Chi-Chi. Wait a second. So does she only have like a, a, like a set amount of things that she can like reply to or something? Is what it is such what it seems like. But it seems like living Chi-Chi kind of did this to dead Chi-Chi? I don't know. Zombies are limited to acting within the confines of their ah. orders. And somehow in this case, the zombie issues her own orders to herself. Interesting. My dear Chi-Chi, we didn't bring a prescription, I'm afraid. But we do hope that you can still help us find some everlasting incense. Yes, please, that okay, would be helpful. Then. Oh, good. How did you manage that? But Chi-Chi helps you. You help Chi-Chi. A contract Only with a zombie. Fair. Since when do customers need to do favors for customer service staff? Oh my Never gosh. Never mind. Just think of it as a peer-to-peer -peer transaction. That way, everybody wins. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sometimes Wait, in Liyue, the art of the deal is simply about victory via mental gymnastics. <laughs> Go to Mount True. Tianhung, find the Guizhong Ballista, and hunt a cocoa goat. Please and thank you. Uh-huh, huh? huh? Guizhong Ballista. Guizhong Ballista. I have heard of this device before. Huh? It's a kind of crossbow turret, installed on Mount Tianhung by an adeptus in the distant past. Oh. An early mechanical device. Okay, Located okay. in Tianhung Pass, it was designed to oh, automatically like fire at large monsters. Protecting Liyue from external threats. Okay. Mr. Zhang Li really knows Liyue inside out. I'm still partially convinced that he is an adeptus. Apparently not quite. This is the first I have ever heard of the Coco Goat. The Coco Goat is a legendary animal. An adepta beast. Do you want me to hunt it? Um, I highly doubt the Adepti will take kindly to that. Do you want to add anything else? No, just that the Coco Goat is a legendary animal, an adepta beast. She's so cute. What it looks like, don't know. Where to find it, don't know either. Where it came from, also don't know. Oh my gosh. Very well then. <laughs> Poor child. Let's start by investigating near the Guizhong Ballista. Perhaps okay. we will find some clues. <sighs> All right, that works. What the heck is a coca goat? I guess we'll find out. How long ago did this child die? Okay, um, up there, I guess. Is there a way to get up to it without, or is there an easier? Let me see. Let's try here. Zhang Li's not an adept. I use a swag though. Okay, awesome. Good to know. Good to know. Yeet. Ah, uh, yes, the ballista. Ooh, there's a chest over there. Ooh, there's a chest here, too. I know there's stuff inside the building because I saw it when I was here before. I'll keep this close. Let's see. It's huge! Mm hmm Paimon can totally believe it took an adeptus to build this. It's not that big, but it is but cool and impressive. How do you operate this thing? Mm -hmm. Just think how much strength you would need. Are there some kind of like gear mechanism that makes it easier to turn? It is currently inoperable in any case. This device is broken. Um can we fix it? After millennia of wear and tear, even Adepti contraptions are difficult to maintain. Understood. It has no string on it. So what are we gonna do? Quick, Mr. Zhongli, 
Use your unlimited high society knowledge powers. <laughs> hmm. You almost make it sound like I'm some sort of bourgeois parasite whose only utility lies in providing quaint pieces of trivia on demand. I mean, that's been your role in the story so far. That said, <laughs> let me think for a moment. Oh my gosh. Ah, yes. Spare parts were made for the Guizhong Ballista when it okay, was first okay. built, in case it was damaged in battle. So where would they be? As I recall, uh -huh. there was a military supply post from that period somewhere inside the pass. Easy. If we can retrieve the spare parts from where they are stored, we may be oh, able to dude, repair the Guizhong Ballista. Sweet chests. One just needs to understand the basic working principles of the device. Got it. So, what you're saying is that you actually understand the working principles? Mm-hmm. I have a smattering of knowledge on the topic. Just a, just a smattering. With the parts in hand, I could at least tinker with it. <laughs> okay, well, let me see if I can get into... Where is that supply post? Aha! Hello! Hello! Okay, I know that there's stuff back here. Nice! Wait, can I? Can I? Oh, I can! It'd be much easier for me to just grab Noelle, but also I do, I'm, I'm lazy. Is this an answer from this Whoop. world? No, I'm, I'm not that lazy. Wait, what? I did a thing, guys, apparently. Hmm. Hmm. I want to get 100% completion in this game. Whoop. Thanks, item. All right. Um. Um. Let me see. Let me see. What else do I need to do? Oh, there's more. Okay. Ah. Nice. Is there anything else here? No, we are good now. Let's go back. What what is this? What is okay, that's not things that wait, what? Go back. Go back. Okay. Back. There we go. <laughs> I wanted to do this. And then I got distracted. Um, um, ba -da -dum, dum, dum. I will protect you. Hello. Okay. Oh, Wait a second. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't think I had to do that. I don't think I even had to do that. Wait, 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 wait. Switch. I'll scout ahead. There we go. I didn't. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I am very simply empty chest. Good for storage. Yay! I am slowly learning how to do this game. I am slowly let me out. Let me out. I'm learning how to play this game, guys. Whoop. Yay! Ooh, can climb. Can climb. I'm gonna be a climby girl. Yeet. Let's fix this. Come on. Come on. Ah. These parts look useful. Uh-huh. One moment. Uh-huh. I will try to repair the device. Yay! It is done. Yay! The Guizhong Ballista is more intricately designed than I thought. Oh, really? Mm. Ooh! Now how do we turn it on? Yeah, I want, I want to see this. It's easy enough. We simply need to do this. Oh. Look, it even has a scope. Can I, can I move? Can I, can I... Over here we have nothing. And over there, more nothing. What are we going to see? Oh, hey, treasure hoarders. Just what do you think you're doing? I so love Razor. He's so this cool. Turret because you're planning to do what exactly? Not a turret. A Guizhong Ballista. Also, kindly state your name before you ask a question. It's just good manners. It truly is. Huh. 
Are you blind or something? You're looking at the leader of the treasure hoarders. The leader. Old man. This for this area or overall? This area is supposed to be chock full of hidden treasures, but you can't get anywhere near them with this thing keeping watch. Uh huh. It might look like any other mechanical device, but trust me, it's got a mind of its own. Wait, so it has been working and Last they broke it? Last time we approached the mountain, it nearly skewered one of our guys. They broke it, didn't a they? Few of it was us one of them. Risked our lives to disarm it, which uh -huh. amazingly we uh -huh. managed. And then we turn our backs for two seconds, and you've already gone and repaired it. Uh, yeah, it's here for a reason, man. You're putting the city in danger. Is your faces, and that's if you get out of this alive. Okay. Uh, that's um. That's yeah. Tut tut. Vandalizing the legacy of an adeptus for selfish gain. Disgraceful behavior. It is not we who need reprimanding, but you. Hi, Lemonade. Welcome. Welcome back. All right, well, time to get rid of these guys. I've been having fun leveling up these characters. Big guy out of the way. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Should replace my hammer. Okay, where's the other guy? Oh hi. I see you down there. Schmack. Oh, there's more? Wait, 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 just a second, just a second, just a moment. Oh. More of them? Just kinda here. Wind blade. Got him. <laughs> I'll keep this close. Wait, stop, stop climbing. Stop climbing. That's enough. Okay, I need to get up there. But not yet. Hi. Goodbye. Da 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 A little more. There we go. There we go. Now we're here. Fry. Have a little out of here. Fry. I'm gonna switch to Kaya for a bit, because Kaya is wonderful. This moment will be frozen in time. Kaya is a favorite to play as. Dodge this. I got careless. Yeah, I start climbing for it. It's it, yeah, it's not fun. Boom! Go away. Go away. Oh dang, that's great. That's satisfying. Go away, good sir. Where are the rest of them? Fry. Oh dang, that wasn't great. I got careless. Fry. Picked the wrong test subject. Okay. Let's get up here. Oh, and they're up there again. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Really? I don't know why I picked Razor, but why not? I think that is that is indeed the answer. By him for a bit. There we go. Ah. Yay! Getting them out of here. I like that you don't actually kill these guys usually. They just kind of like teleport away as if they're Endermen. 
and have little little tender pearls. There we go. Um, hi, sir. Goodbye, sir. One more. Hi. Whoop. I think that's all of them. Yeah, Genshin Enderman. Yes. <laughs> Okay, be nice, Paimon. I know they're trying to kill me, but there's no need to be name calling. Troubling no ourselves over this rabble is not worth the time. Okay. We should focus on our contract with Chi Chi. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that! Yep. So we've got the Guizhong Ballista working, but where's our Coca Goat? A search using the Guizhong Ballista revealed no significant life forms nearby, save for the usual wildlife. Is there someone local here we could talk to about it? What's more? A contraption built using Adeptus technology should have no trouble detecting an Adepta beast, as Chi Chi put it. This is true, so I guess they're not uh, around here. The Paimon wouldn't go that far. We did something positive, right? Mm hmm. Gee, the Coco Goat? Wait. Yeah, Razor is a good boy. We, we like won't Razor. won't solve anything while standing here and racking our brains. Let's return to Boo Boo Pharmacy. Explain that we could not find a cocoa goat and review our next step. I mean, my gut Good says let's idea. talk to someone here, but I guess the story's not gonna give us much choice. This is true. Everyone does their best, though. Everyone does their best. Everyone's best is different, however. Hey, yo! Hey, yo! Before I head back, I'm gonna try and um, grab the chest. What? Wait, 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 wait. What does this say? The Guijan Ballista has an intricate machine, a divine contra con conception, and it could only come to fruition at the hands of mortal craft. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, interesting. Cool stuff. Craftsman suitable caliber and clear it must be summoned to collect them. Note to the collector, the structural parts, namely the beams and bow limbs, will be all be found folded and stacked in the storage room. Okay. So if anyone has trouble finding them, that's that's how they any trouble finding the parts, that's that's a good way for them to to learn where the parts are. Hmm. There we go. Right. Yay. We are going to get this chest. Hi, buddy. And I'm going to, to go talk to one of the one of the um, the Archon statues as soon as possible because my health is going low, and that is one way. Whoops! Didn't mean to do that, but it works. Let me grab this real quick. I'll keep this close. I'm gonna level up. One of our people in just a moment. Ow! Go away! Go away! Go away! All of you, go away! I dislike you. I dislike you. You're mean? <gasps> There's more. Whoa. Didn't mean to do that again. I'll keep this close. Hey. Wait, can I get a Oh, let me check something. Let me grab that. Firstly, and let me see here. I'm looking for Literally all Is there not a thing, not one of these, that's three stars. Is does do they not exist? Because this is the only item that I currently have that is not either three or four stars. It's frustrating, guys. It's very frustrating. Oh my gosh. Oh, I can make I can make biscotti, guys. I have made biscotti. Confirm. Uh, let's go back here. Down. <gasps> Hi. Bye. Freeze. Simple. We've gotten good at playing this game. These things. Don't think useful? it is. Dang. So. 
I, I, there's gotta be one somewhere where there's a three star, but I, I hate it. All right. Do your thing, Amber. And now, boom. <laughs> Quite the find. Ah, <sighs> look at that. Easy. E Z. Let's go What's the quickly. Hurry? Before we go any further, I want to talk to whoever it is that's the little exclamation point. No, they are above us. They are above us. If I don't go talk to them now, I will simply forget. La da da da. Da 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 da. Oh, stop that. Oh, this is so pretty. You, sir, must be who I'm looking for. Leave me alone. Hi. I would like to, I would like to discuss with you our Lord and Savior, Geo Archon. Um, oh, can't be performed during combat. I'm not meant to be in combat. Hmm. Yeah, frustrating. I didn't mean to begin my combat. It just happened. Yeah. Oh, hello. Look, there's a thing here. There is a thing. There is a thing. I can do the thing. Ah, <gasps> the city. <laughs> He's so pretty. Down I go. Chi-Chi! Hello, Chi-Chi! Forgive us. We were unable to fulfill our end of the contract. Mm -hmm. We found no trace of the Cocoa Goat Adepti Beast of which you speak. Mm -hmm. <sighs> what a disappointment. Is it an Don't extinct thing? Maybe? But I feel very disappointed. Mm -hmm. Oh, poor Chi-Chi. Chi -chi. Yep, that's my words. Why does Paimon feel so guilty all of a sudden? Cocoa hmm. goat milk is tasty. So tasty. Oh. Much better than normal goat milk. Only an adult Wait, Cocoa could goat. Make such tasty Is she milk. just want chocolate milk? Is that all she wants? Oh, this precious child! Oh my gosh! I'm sorry. I have a poor memory. She just wants chocolate I milk! I remember the name of the milk. That's why I wrote it down. Where no, just chocolate milk. I the cocoa goat. It? It's like coca powder. Ah, here. Wait, this coconut milk. Never mind, you are correct. Coconut milk. We can literally just- we can get you coconut? We can get you coconut, sweet thing! I owe you both an apology. I hastily agreed to what appeared to be an equitable agreement with this zombie oh child. Oh my gosh. When perhaps I should have That would have been really funny, Chalky Milk. Never I want Chalky Milk now, oh my gosh. I need to find a Cocoa Goat, guys! Literally no one could have seen this coming. Poor little child. Excuse me, everyone. Did Chi Chi no, say Chi -Chi, a bad thing? No, Chi you've said nothing wrong, you sweet child. You're fine. Aww. Sorry, but Paimon's gonna leave the job of shattering this poor kiddo's world to you. No. Im impossible. You just need coconuts, sweetheart. Since Chi Chi took this pretty hard. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait, who is this? Someone learned a valuable life lesson today, then. Thank you all for looking after my little Chi Chi. Who is this? Might I ask who? Ah, oh, how rude of me. Baiju? I'm Baiju, boss of the Boo Boo Pharmacy. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's really funny. Paimon thought Chi Chi was the boss. 
Turns out it's some wacko who wears medicinal ingredients around his back. Are you calling that snake an ingredient? Little Miss Emergency Food? Oh my gosh. It's a snake. It's a pet. It's cute, okay? Oh, this guy is a is a, a, a dentro wielder. What a sorry state of affairs. <gasps> this little mascot is even more of a simpleton than Chi Chi. It talks? Ah, the medicine, the snake is speaking. <laughs> I prefer to stay silent, but faced with strangers, oh. I must speak, lest you mistake me for an escapee from the medicine cabinet, for I am a living, breathing serpent. I like the snake. I like the snake, guys. <laughs> it's got a sharp Don't tongue. Don't mind Chung Shung. She's a good girl, really. Chung Shung? As for you three... Communal chaos <laughs> Chi Chi aside, what business brings you here? We need to get coconut milk. Do you sell everlasting incense in this fine establishment? Mm -hmm. Everlasting incense? Why, of course we do. That took us so long. Oh, at last, things are finally starting to come together. Uh-huh, uh -huh. Three million more. Top what? Point, guaranteed. Aw, oh, too bad the Chi Sing have taken it over for now. Security oh will be tighter than gosh. usual. Wait a second. So we're gonna have to go in and steal? Mm, this is not the second time that we've had to steal for the greater good. Hmm. Three million. An innocuous number Excuse in and of me? itself. Though practically speaking, it could be a hard sum to come by. Of course. It's a crazy number. We'd never be able to make that much more of. And as for Mr. Zhang Li, he's around three million short. Oh my gosh, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Mm. We were offered a very, very attractive offer to give information, uh, and in return, the vault thing would be left open. Only villains used for the greater good. I'm starting to think I may be villainhood, at, villain at, or at the very least Robin Hood in this situation. For being a hero, I sure do some sketchy things. This is correct. Oh my gosh. Gonna do? Is this the part where we go crawling back to child? Uh, you need to give information. <laughs> okay, just stop that, Mr. Go, go, child go. in it. Go, go, go. <laughs> my sides hurt. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe you fell for that. Screw you. Hey, less laughter, more sympathy. I don't think we deserve sympathy, Paimon, but it is cute. I'm almost in tears over here. Uh, thank you. That was the best laugh I've had in a long time. In return, I'm more than happy to sort out this mess you've managed to get yourselves into. Please. Excuse me, sir. Dr. Baiju, isn't it? Uh-huh. Truly honored. I'm Child, one of the Fatui Harbingers. Forgive my audacity, but I see a great many opportunities for us to collaborate in the future. This is interesting. I'm just noticing there's like a scorpion pattern on his back. That's kind of cool. Or maybe it's a fish. I don't know. If Boo Boo Pharmacy needed a stable supply of, say, coconut milk, the Fatui could help by setting up a robust and speedy distribution network. It's an awesome offer, but also... Strange. I knew the Fatui infiltrated businesses with seductive deals, but so much fuss over coconut milk? Mm, coconut milk. Baiju, quick. Chi Chi wants coconut milk. Oh, sweet ah, child. Yes, of course, Chi Chi. Anything you want. Thank you, oh, child. I am so glad I don't have to steal. Collaboration in the future. I can give you a discount on that everlasting incense. Excuse too. me. Let's say two million nine hundred and ninety thousand more. It's not much of a discount, sir. It's, it's like a 0.1% hmm. difference. 2,990,000. Or 0.01, also I don't an know. Also an number in and of itself. Though practically speaking, it is a whole 10,000 less than the original sum of 3 million. Well, now is, that this is settled... Can this guy settled, not do math? We must head back to Yujing Terrace. Mr. Child, Dr. Baiju, Little Miss Chi Chi, see you soon. I love Chi Chi, guys. She's so sweet. Okay. Um, child. Uh, that lot is an absolute riot. 
Honestly, I can't remember the last time I laughed so hard. It's 10,000 less. I mean, 10,000 is 10,000, but not much compared to 3 million. So, you've been eavesdropping, I hope. What have I missed? Yes, Master Child. Oh my they gosh. They spoke of the Qixing taking the Golden House. We did, didn't we? Well, well, well. Ningguang and her Qixing cronies. What else would they be hiding in the Golden House, if not the Exuvia? I apologize, but I warned you, didn't I? As the old Leo is saying goes, the walls have ears. So they, okay, they're hiding, the Qixing are hiding the body of the, they're hiding the Exuvia. And the Fatui have been so generous in helping to plan the the funeral for the Exuvia. Um, you buy 50? Excuse me. Were you going to get that kind of money? Like, you can count, you can count the people who have that kind of money in, in, in the world today. Ah. Oh. All right. <laughs> oh my gosh. A million more. Oh my gosh. In two days it was gone? Excuse me. I tend to sit with my Mora in somewhere in the low 10,000 stuff. Low tens of thousands because I am always like upgrading stuff. But it's fine. I haven't needed that much lately. Well, as it stands, we've hired helpers and we've acquired the everlasting incense. Mm -hmm. The completion of our preparations is not far off. Okay, what else do we need? Ooh, finally. Well, traveler, have you gained anything from our adventure so far? Information. Odd. Um... <laughs> Which is it, I wonder? The questions that such travels raise are ever so <laughs> complicated. Well, I'll leave you to ruminate over it yourself. To treat you to a meal. Oh, Seriously? Ah, uh, yes, don't worry. I will remember to bring the Mora this time. Thank you. Tonight, I shall take you both to an old hole in the wall, praised throughout Liu. That sounds interesting. Hole in the wall? As in a cool restaurant? Uh-huh. <laughs> Indeed. Let us meet near the harbor at third round knockout. Nice. Gonna learn a little bit more about, about, uh... Ooh, hello. Okay, okay. Here, real quick. Before heading out, before heading there, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some stuff real quick. Here. All of my, all of my stuff for, uh, my my character for the traveler is fully maxed out i'm trying to max out um trying to max out what's his name <laughs> trying to max out kaya kaya's artifacts and so i'm just kind of doing this just a little at a time just a little at a time ta-da just kind of add things to it I've locked the ones that um, that I don't want to use. It's a literal hole in the lit. What? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I expect no less. I expect no less from Zhongli at this point. He looks so sophisticated and and like he's this this. Oh my gosh. There's literally nothing that can surprise me about Zhongli at this point. Okay. Anything interesting here? Anything? Oh, white tassel. Hmm. Halberd. I know this one's not really anything special, but I am going to keep it because it's kind of cool. Let's go enhance. Is there anything interesting here? Ta-da! Cool. You don't actually know. Oh my gosh. Don't hit auto add. It's dude, it's fun. It's fun for me. Don't don't hate. Don't hate. Come on. Okay, so that's not anything that's okay, it's literally I can just add all of them. 
What happens if I hit auto add? I mean, nice. Anything else? Okay, all of these are just, they're just things that we, yeah. Nice. Play Slime Rancher 2. I actually, oh, dude, I was going to add that earlier. I'm sorry if I if I popped my mic. Um, yeah, I was thinking about that earlier, and I'm like, I need to play Slime Rancher. I need to play Slime Rancher. So, yes. Thank you. How is that game? Oh, it's really, it's, it's, I've never played it. I've never played it, but I want to. Let me see. Anything else here? No, you're not interesting. You are interesting. We're going to use this. We're going to go here, and we're going to level up. Let me see. We'll use two. Confirm. Hmm. I love Razor. He's so cute. Wait. Confirm. That's totally fine. Okay. Now, what does it take to ascend Razor so that we can be on the lookout for these things? That and that. Okay. Nice. Good to know. Let's give the rest of these things... Um... Let's start working hard on leveling up Bennett. And I knew I do need to work on Barbara as well because she's the only oh, Hydra wielder that I have. Oh, my big sister. She's so cute. She's so cute. Got a lot of like character love love stuff that I can use. Dang. I need to do some cool stuff with all these things that I have. Aha, I can use those. Camera, special camera. Kind of looking through stuff. Ancient investigation journal. Cool stuff. What else do I have? Oh, I've got these. I forgot about these. Dang. Yeah, I do have Bennett. I do have Bennett. Dang. That's sad. That's sad. Okay. Uh, give me just one second. I'll be right back. I just have to run to the restroom and I'll be back. I'm back. Wait a second. Who is... Huh? Oh, wait a second. That's Chi-Chi. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm eventually... I, I have been saving up my, my Prima Gems recently. And so I did last night finally reach enough to get... To, to, to do ten wishes at once, but I got to... I got a whipping. You get a whipping instead of a character, and I'm still mad. I'm still a little bit mad. Uh, let's go to third round knockout. Where is it? Whoop. <sighs> it wasn't a bad weapon, don't get me wrong, but I'm just mad. Still. Um... 
So it's near the harbor, right? Whoop. So I guess we just do this. La <laughs> la. Let's sit down, of course. Nice. Ah, you're here. There's no need to order. I've already done so. Nice. Third round knockout is not for lightweights, like those <laughs> taverns in Mondstadt. <laughs> lightweights? Here, the owner oh does not gosh. take such unorthodox orders as fruit juice. Oh my gosh. Yeah, five, five stars. Dang. Dang. Yeah, I don't have any five stars yet. I ordered some wine-fermented sweet rice balls for you, if that counts. Oh my gosh. If it is to your liking, dear customers, I shall continue the tale of Lady Ningguan's Jade Chamber. Ooh, stories. Hey, there's even a storyteller here. Great atmosphere. Nice. Besides fine wine, the excellent ambiance is the reason why this place is so well loved. Nice. But when I say ambiance, I refer to a different sort from the one the Tevat Travel Guide uses to judge other establishments. Really? As you all know, high above the land of Liyue lies a pavilion in the clouds. Oh yeah. A palace I remember in that. the mist. It's what so we can does see it. it mean to have all seeing eyes? Mm -hmm. This, my friends. That's Lady right. We still haven't met Lady Mingguang. That bridges earth and sky. Imagine. Will we get to, I wonder. The weather is clear, and you gaze down from the deck on the world below. <laughs> Behold, the glorious sights of Liyue her? Harbor, stretching out far and wide. It's beautiful. Ooh. They say that when Story Lady time. Ningguang ponders important affairs, she retreats to her jade chamber. Well, we get to see it. But her three closest confidants in tow. <laughs> Why brings she these trusted Lady three Ningguang. to sift through Very sources, dig through documents, looking for information? About Piece by piece, facts and figures paint a picture on the walls of the chamber. Uh -huh. But well before the wall is filled, Lady Ningguang's mind is made up. Uh -huh. Having made her call, she has every last document shredded, and whoosh, she scatters the shavings out her window. Wow. Ah, look at that. Sounds like How she just makes endless conspiracy walls over like and over a and over. Sudden swirling blizzard. As the fragments fall, traces of text Man, flicker before the eyes of like the that. merchants of Liyue. Like ink stains and white snow. It feels very goes, poetic and fitting. The rarest treasures in the land. For for the a place built on contracts. Like paper snow. For the words of the Tian Twen have the power to move mountains wow. and all throughout the land know it. Wow. Amazing. I like it. I like the story. These are but scraps of paper, and yet they guide Lady Ningguang's hand. Such is their value. Noise. Merely grasping one or two of them will surely gift you a fragment of her wisdom. Enough to stay a step or two ahead of your peers. Nice. Tiantuan Ningguang. Feels like we're hearing this name a lot. Mm-hmm. I hope we get to meet her. Really locals talk about her. Mm -hmm. The Fatui hate her. <laughs> She's most likely the one who hid the Exuvia, and we saw her at the Rite of Dissension. Mm-hmm. Huh. Paimon wonders what sort of person Ooh, we she did, is. Didn't we? we did, didn't we? At last, I have found you. Wait. You who returned from Juayun Karst. <gasps> what? Who's there? Wait, I am not with the who Millilith. Who is this? Nor am I here to claim your bounty. There's a bounty on me? However, I am an emissary of the Leo Ganyu! Chisen. My name is Ganyu, secretary at the Yua High Pavilion, and I have come specifically to meet you. Well, uh -huh. in concrete terms, I am the corporate secretary for the Chising, 
At the moment, I am serving as Lady Ningguang's special emissary. Okay, wait, are you one of the three? Or no? Ningguang sent you? Wow. We were literally just talking about her. Wow. Oh Our my gosh, Strike. you who have returned from Jiayun Karst. I am duty-bound and cannot extend my courtesy to you in full. Oh no. But I have with me a letter from Lady Ningguang. She extends a formal invitation to you in her capacity as Tianquan. Wow. She invites you to her palace in the sky. <gasps> we get to see it! An official invitation? Lady Ningguang said this. Invite her to come here. I wish to meet her. At wow. the Jade Chamber, together we shall snip every one of these entwining dark threads. Oh, so we finally get some answers! Ooh, we're not going to be able to give information to, uh... Wow. And with that, the emissary who called herself Ganyu just disappeared. But we've hmm. received an invitation from the Liu at Qixing. Paimon Wait, he was right here. Why didn't, why didn't, oh. We'll be meeting people that why are, are you just recounting this? Money than Paimon, could ever count. Paimon, you just want to be rich. Be you just want to be rich. <laughs> An invitation to visit the Jade Chamber is a rare honor indeed. Mm -hmm. You'd best be on your way now. But don't forget about the rite of parting. Once you've finished at the Jade Chamber, meet me at Dihua Marsh. Nice. Don't worry, we won't forget. We will not. Dihua Marsh. We'll see you there. Nice. Yeah, it's not surprising that I have a bounty on me. It's not surprising that I have a bounty on me, considering all of the crazy stuff I've done. No! Wait, 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 wait. Just wait, wait, wait. What is this? The floating palace. Okay, so we're gonna navigate there. What else is here? What else? Ministry missions. Miss Yu, a resource manager for the Ministry of Civil. Oh! Wait, wait, wait. Does this mean that I now have a reputation stuff? I now have reputation stuff. In 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 Liyue. I hope it does. I hope it does. Anyway, um, just, 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 one second, one second, profile, voiceover, um, we unlock so many things, we see. How does it un just so I don't have a little thing. Where is it? Constellation. It's this, the Animo, that we use. Constellation. Who uses the red, then? It's me in the future, isn't it? It's me in the future. It means that it's a, that's, this is what I use. What I The thing that I got is what I use to, uh, to unlock certain aspects of my constellation. Later. Okay. Um, wow. Nice. What else? What's left here? What's left in this one? Dang. Not a whole lot. Zoo Tycoon Omni Ubiquity Net. I have no idea how to use that. Activate 10 tunes. I don't know what that is. Reputation level 8. Reputation level 8. Complete 10 bounties. This one is the closest. I'm, I don't know closest to. Level 10. Okay. Well, um, that's, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Anything else here before I head on? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, let's teleport here. Alright, where are we? We gotta go up there. Easy. Easy. get stuff while I'm here. Do I have to climb up using the... I think I have to climb up using these. Stop. Don't. Do that. Don't do that, please. Okay. Stop hitting me, please. Stop! <laughs> Of course, this happens every time. Huh. 
<sighs> you know what? I guess we're just gonna have to take care of this our way. Freeze! I've already dealt with these jokers once before. Why do they continue to to do this? Anyone else? Anyone else? Oh, there you are. Hello. Dang. My little friend here hits hard. Razor hits hard. Hi. Let's gather up our spoils. Um, let me let me grab the thing, please. Let me see what is here. Entima elemental reaction catalyze, huh? Electro and dendro quicken will occur, which render them quickened. When the quickened creatures are affected by electro or dendro attacks, yeah. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Interesting stuff. And we go like this. Claim. And now we go like, uh, quickly. Like this. Use bop. Because apparently I am completely unable to keep myself alive. Wait. Um. Use. Confirm, 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 confirm. What's the hurry? Oh, come on. Let me get up the thing. I want up the mountain, please. Oh. Hi. to things that don't have shields. But of course, elemental shields are annoying. Ha! Challenge completed! Precious chest, what's in here? Is this a berserker's timepiece. And here is wit. And prima gems! Always prima gems. Noctilus of Jade. Now let's get this, and then let's head out. Um, up we go, up the thing, not sure if I'm going to be able to get this or not, look up there, oh, the Jade Chamber, that was a strange way to, okay, Supposed to be your guide, but Byron doesn't know where the way up to the Jade 
chamber is. Oh my gosh. <sighs> we should have. We should have asked Ganyu. And also, Paimon's supposed to be my guide? What? I, I don't know what kind of guidance she's been offering this entire time, but mostly it's just me feeding her. Well, since we want to go to the Jade Chamber, heading to its location on the map is the sensible thing to do. Sensible, yeah. Let's look around. There has to be a way up there nearby. Uh-huh. Let's see, what's up here? Uh, oh! I know what this is! Hey, look! There's some sort of mechanism thingy! Mm-hmm. It's a pinwheel. Since this is the right place, it must have something to do with the Jade Chamber. Yes, this must be the way. Uh-huh. All right. Uh, I know what to do here. We go like this, we go like uh, that. Let me down. Hey, thanks for the posture check, the hydrate, and the stretch. Give me a minute. I will indeed do this thing. Oh, no. Alright, let me try this again. Come on, come on. We go like this. And down we go. Do we have to be invited uh -huh. further? If that wind current was stronger, we'd be able to reach the top in one go. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Just a second. Let me hide you real quick. Uh -huh. And then stretch. And then my posture has been checked. Thank you guys. Oh. Dang. All right. Okay. Best way to best way back to uh huh. Why? Or. Hmm. Oh, Paimon gets it. If it was a secret, Ganyu wouldn't have let us try to find it ourselves, right? Well, I guess something. <sighs> Thank you for the porcupine fish. All right, let's follow your plan. Then we can. Oh, hang on a moment. Look down there. Looks like we've gotten close to the Guizhong Ballista. Uh, I guess so. Hmm. <gasps> Paimon has a new idea. Do we do we shoot ourselves up there using the the Guizhong Ballista? Why don't we shoot? You oh my to gosh! The chamber using the ballista. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna try that. Right. This method as fun as it would be. A bit unsafe. Yeah, I'm uh, expecting um, Ningguang or Ganyu to show up and help us out here. Oh, that's right. Now that you mention it, we could use the Guizhong ballista to see if there's another way up nearby. Exactly. That's awesome. Alright, well, let's open the chest real quick. Is this an answer from this world? Two Prima Gems, nice. Now, where is the Guizhong Ballista from here? This direction. Oop. Look at that. Hey, thanks for the work, Pengu. Should I fight a thing, guys? Should I fight a thing? I kind of want to fight a thing. Oh wait, no, I don't want to fight that thing. If it were merely a a um a ruined guard, that'd be one thing, but this thing these things are are ridiculous and difficult. I will I will come back and attack him another day. Give me a second. As you wish. All right, thank you. Go, go, That's not what I meant to do. Leave it all to me. Ow. Is Ooh, this an gems. answer from this Again. world? Is the thing that we were chasing is? Are they down there now? I think they went down here. Where'd it go? Buddy! Where 
where's the where he be where he be I don't know then you all see where you want Now, since I don't have any chance of uh, springing into combat yet, what are you up to? Oh, poor guy. We play hide and seek. No hiding and seeking today. I'll find you some other time though, and we'll play then. La -da -da. Okay, thank you so much, Lemonade. Sleep well. Wait a second, why is there a... Huh? Where is the... I guess it's... I guess it's somewhere else? Huh? There's supposed to be a... Um, a geoculus ge ge somewhere around here. Yeah? Who trespasses on these hallowed grounds? Um... Exactly! What are you talking about? We're invited guests! <laughs> what makes you think you can treat us like this? No... Wait! Maybe this was Ningwan's plan all along! Oh, She pretended what? to invite us to the Jade Chamber, but set up a megalith ambush here to arrest us! How would Ningguang think that we would come here? We don't know the way into the palace. Into the into the Jade Chamber. How how does she mm, my gosh. Uh, now Paimon's mad! You! Over there! This is a trick, isn't it? How shameless! Paimon, calm down. What? We're just on guard duty. What do you mean shameless? What nonsense! Seize these suspicious intruders at once! That's really not going to work out well for you, sir. We are the invited guests of the Ning of Ningguang. Well, here they come. Line them up and knock them down. Also, I am an Animo and Geo wielder. You need to just calm, calm yourself, please. Be gone. Oh, more of them? Really? Give me a challenge at least. I've been doing this for a while now, guys. Oh, I shouldn't ask for that, honestly. I have I have a sneaking suspicion it is not going to work out well for me. Prepare to be blown away! Goodbye. Who goes there? I meant to hold that, I did not know. There we go. Wing lead. That was ineffective use of that. Good luck. Got him. Stop. What's all this about? Lady Kuchin. A, a fatui? These two strange people suddenly appeared. They see- Who are you calling strange? Oh my gosh. Hmm? You want to go to the Jade Chamber? Who are you? Invited guests. We're invited guests. Yes. Here to look for the Lyra Chising. Who are you? Well, what? as it happens, I am one of the Liwe Chising. Oh. I'm Kuching, the Yuhung of the Chising. Okay, I don't know what Yuhung is, but okay. You're Ningguang's guests, yes? Yes! Okay, didn't thank you. Someone who knows what's going on. Here in the mountains. Yeah, sorry we didn't know the way and thought we'd use the I thing to help. We'd meet some super rich big shot out here in the middle of nowhere either. 
Paimon, why do you think everyone's rich? The Guizhong Ballista in Tianhong Pass has long been in disrepair. And yet, it was fixed in a single night. Mm -hmm. That was us. I came here to investigate that occurrence. That was us. These Millilith are just here to guard the scene. Not to arrest anyone. I don't want to tell them that. So, this was all a misunderstanding? Paimon never would have thought. Anyway... For a mortal to be able to repair an Adepti mechanism is quite the mystery, even to the Cheesing. I mean, we have no reason to believe that we are entirely mortal, but okay. Uh, that was... Huh? Oh, right. So, Lady Yuru, <laughs> Thank goodness, Paimon learning to keep her mouth shut. Do why Lady Tian invited us to go to the Jade Chamber? Yeah. Just call me Kuching. Kuching. Got it. I'd say that Ningguang's I'm definitely gonna forget to that name, but it's okay. The savior of Mondstadt take a more neutral stance, mm -hmm. or at least to not wholly side with the Adepti. Why? We're not taking sides. We spoke with the Adepti. They want to protect Liu as well. When you say protect, you're referring to their sanctimonious arrogance, aren't you? Uh huh. Now we're getting to see the other side a little bit. Oh wait, she's a uh, she's a an Electra user. Huh? You are mortals, and thus under their protection. There was no way they would have regarded you as someone with the ability to assassinate a god. We didn't. Naturally, they would also regard Ningguang's locking down the area, questioning the citizenry, and pursuit of the assassin to be pointless work. Perhaps they even wonder if there might be a cover-up. <laughs> I'll say it like it is. They're underestimating us. Wait a second, but you're not denying. You're saying that that's the be well, that's that's the least of it. you've got a point there. Still, this is the first time Paimon's seen a person from Liyue who doesn't respect the gods or the Adepti. <laughs> <laughs> Should I respect the shallow sense of time and condescension to mortals that has caused them to delay in moving against us, Chising? Wait, you uh, uh, what? Forget it. I shouldn't speak of them this way. This skepticism is mine alone. And Ningguang does not share it. I'm a little um, iffy on what her viewpoint actually is, even though she just explained it. I'm like, I'm still confused. Either way, I will admit that the actions of the Adepti this time were quite restrained. Rex Lapis's death is indeed an extraordinary circumstance. But to think that they would call for a council of Adepti rather than come down here directly. Maybe you misunderstand them. How surprisingly civilized of them. I think you misunderstand them. Well, for Ningguang, she would talk anything and everything out if she could. But I doubt we can do that here. Are you working against Ningguang? The time of or the Adepti has long passed. From her? If even the Liyue Qixing don't want to face that truth, then what future is there for Liyue? <sighs> Another super bold statement! This is borderline, um... What do you call it? This is... There's a specific word I'm looking for and I can't remember. Very, very, um, seditious statements. <sighs> I'll stop here. Honestly, I hadn't intended to say so much. But you're a good listener, Traveler. Mm -hmm. You should both be off to the Jade Chamber. Don't be late now. Ningguang's schedule is packed to the gills all the way till next year. Uh, can you tell us how the to get there? The cream of Liyue's mercantile crop all see ascending to the Jade Chamber oh, is wow. the greatest honor. Each brings rich gifts as they visit, all to curry a little favor with Ningguang. Okay. Favor? But oh my gosh. My... Wait, on. that's right. Greeting gifts are a staple of Liyue's culture. I mean, that's true. To not to curry favor or anything, just to respect Liu's culture. All right, all right. You can decide on your greeting gift yourselves. Let me tell you how to get Please, to the Jade Chamber yeah. first. By the way, I think her hair is super cute. I, 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 I love that. It's adorable. <laughs> you didn't actually have to come to Mount Tianhong. Go back to Liyue Harbor. Find a guide at the Yuhai Pavilion. And, well then... May we meet again, Traveler? Right. Well, that Yuhung may not respect the gods, but Paimon thinks she's a pretty cool person. She's interesting. So, what should we give to Ningguang when we see her? 
Oh my gosh. Oh, right. Paimon, Paimon you... Paimon dreamed of an amazing snack last night. Sugar frosted slime. Please. What? Paimon. I don't understand you, child. I don't understand you, small floating person. Also, why do you float? Why? Why do you float? Paimon has a feeling that it would be perfect for a super rich person like Mingua. Why don't we go with that for a gift? You have a nope. recipe? But Paimon's sure that we just need to make it with some boom shakalaka. Okay. No, Let's go no more. Our ingredients. Time waits for no one, and neither will our riches. Paimon, oh my gosh. She just wants to be rich. She just wants to be rich. That's all she wants. <laughs> Why no float? This is also this is a, this is fair, this is fair, but also, why float? I want okay. The question is less why and more how. How does Paimon float? What is the story behind this? Ooh. I have not explored this much at all. little buzzy things. Leave me alone. I must leave no stone unturned. Ah, <sighs> there we go. So that's done. Oh wait, hello. Don't question plot. But what if I want to? What if the, the plot deserves to be questioned? What if the plot confuses me? Hello. Stay away from me. They get to stay away from me. A little dusty. Best give it a spring cleaning. Leave it all to me. See, this is what happens. Excuse me, boys. This is what happens when you mess. Trap. This is this is what happens. You get walked with a claymore. Wop. 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 I must leave no stone unturned. They're dead. Now, is there a chest for me to get? No. Okay, I'm going to take this moment to quickly revive some characters. Um, 
Here, I'll use this. It's not great, but I want it out. I want it out of my inventory. Boom. Cancel. All right, what's here? Huh? Is it just Paimon? Or is there a sweet fragrance in the air? I don't know. Apparently, I have no sense of smell in this universe. Huh? Because it's on my computer Did you screen. Hear that? What is it? Uh, no! That was definitely someone in trouble. Oh no! It came from those ruins over there. What is person doing uh -oh. in the cage? It looks oh. like the treasure orders have locked someone inside. Well, seeing as they have no leader right now, because we did uh, kind of smite their previous leader. Leave me alone, please. You're open. Cool it. Leave it all to me. You can't hurt me. You can't touch me. I've got a shield. I've got a shield. Woo! I mean, she's she's cool. I need to. I need. I really need to um to work on leveling her up a little bit more because she is freaking awesome. No way. He's gone. One more, I think. Hi. Do you not see? I have a shield. Aha. Someone needs assistance. Let's help him. Oh wait. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Gonna get rid of all our bad food. Because right now we don't have like a pressing need for great health. We just need we just have we need decent health. There we go. And then we need to make more, more, more jelly next chance we get. Confirm. Mengdon. <sighs> Thank you for your help, kind travelers. No problem. If you hadn't come to my aid, I surely would have rotted in this cell. How can I help you? I was nothing. No need to thank us all at once or anything. No, it's fine. <laughs> I understand. Don't worry. I will compensate you both. You do Don't not need say to. That. I only escaped this predicament because of you. I'm Meng Dan, a okay, supplier Dan. for Mingxing Jewelry in Liyue oh. Harbor. I often walk around these mountains in search of antiques. That's helpful. I never expected that those treasure hoarders would have their eyes on the same ruins that I had. <laughs> Before I knew it, they'd caught and imprisoned me. They really Is shouldn't be doing that. Is there anything that you lack? Uh, antiques, treasure, various knickknacks, you name it. Well, as long as you want what I have to offer, of course. Wait a moment. Actually, we are looking for something. Huh? What are we looking for? What might that be? Do you have a box that can store presents? We oh! Like a pretty one. The kind that you can use to store snacks. That's a great idea, Paimon. Of course we do. How can one sell antiques without gift boxes? Mm -hmm. At Mingxing Jewelry, we have the best gift wrapping service in the Seven Nations. Good now, to just know. Just give me a moment, and I'll let the boss know. You can go see her whenever you require that box. Perfect. Great. You're awesome, sir. Hyman sugar frosted slime now comes in a beautiful package. Nice. Okay, let's see. What other ingredients do we have? Ah, perfect. Okay, let's go to Mixing Jewelry then. I'll be back here someday soon. Hello, statue in the water. Is there something at the bottom of this lake? To lower the lake at some point. Can I lower the lake now? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh -hoo. Ooh -hoo -hoo -hoo. Obviously, this needs to happen. Come on. That. Where are the rest of them? Where be the rest of them? Where's the rest of ya? Bet you can't keep up with me! Huh. Uh -huh. 
Uh-huh. Where's the rest of them? No, there's probably at least one more. I'll race you there. Usually they usually they do four. Sometimes more. Anything else here? Oh, hi. Is the water lowering? This is a different music cue, so maybe? A little dusty. Best give it a spring cleaning. Amber. We're still missing it. We're still missing something. around here. I'm sure there's more. I don't want to have to deal with them right now. I really don't. Oh, hello. No oh, hi. Oh, that scared me. Leaving so soon. Yeah, uh, I guess so. Is this an answer from this world? We're just leaving. We're just leaving, guys. We're just leaving. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm I'm I am I am I am leaving. We just leave. <laughs> we leave. We leave. We leave. All right. Um Ancient jewelry. Ha! A place that half the time doesn't have someone behind the counter. Jingji, I think. Jingji. Hey there! A guy called Meng Dan told us that we could get a nice and shiny box from your store. Yay! They've got plenty of boxes here. These Uncle are beautiful. Uncle Meng already told me about it. Thank you both for saving him. <laughs> Many of the best goods in our store were found by Uncle Mung. Oh wow! If anything were to happen to him, these are beautiful it would be impossible pins. Impossible for us to continue doing business. Here, this container is itself an antique with at least 140 years of history. It's already been cleaned. Will it do? Um, can we see it? Yep, yep, yep. It's great. Hang on a moment. Can we borrow one other thing? Well, that was spliced together. Sure. Please help yourselves, as long as it's on our shelves. Thank you. Trevor, this clay pot looks really awesome. If we use an antique as our mixing bowl, we should be able to make a great snack. Um, if you say so, Paimon. It's done! The one and only sugar frosted slime. Beautiful. Carefully now, into the box it goes and dust it over with a bit more powdered sugar. See, it sounds like Turkish Delight. I've only had sh Turkish Delight once, and I think I made it wrong because it really did sound like sugar coated. It, it was like sugar coated, coated slime. It was really not great. Oh, yes. Also, it was you rose flavored, which I'm never doing two again. Freshly picked flowers as decorations, too. Oh, Yay! so nice. It looks beautiful. That is stunning. But I can't imagine it would taste great. Great. Now that we've put all that we've got into this box, let's go to the Jade Chamber to see Ningguang. I am excited to meet Ningguang. <laughs> oh my gosh. Koki Chicken, uh, thank you for redeeming that, but what the heck? <laughs> You scared me! Who do we need to talk to? Oh! Oh, our oh guide? God, you Maybe? Let me finish. No, wait. Can't stand it. What's going on? Um. I can help.
Okay. Welcome, welcome, Cookie Chicken. You scared me so bad. Here, real quick. Let me quickly just take care of this, and then I will head to do things. I'll head to do the things. Yeah, it's one of those things that they that some of those sounds truly transcend the game. It's like you doesn't matter. Doesn't matter that I'm not playing Minecraft. I am just I, I'm jumpy. I'm jumpy. Friendship improved. Okay. I wasn't really paying attention. I wasn't aware that there was something important here. Alright, well then let's go find Jiangzhou. Jiangzhou? <laughs> oh dang. I I I well, I need to brush up. Here's what I need to do. I need to actually look up okay, how are you supposed to pronounce this and actually figure out some of the, the rules of pronunciation for, for this, because it's really interesting. And I want to do it, even outside of just game stuff. I love learning this kind of stuff, so. Okay. Mm hmm and This is true. Um. Let's see. Scared yourself enough times you thought it was a, is a ghost walking around because- Oh, seriously? Um. Hmm. You can do this. Thank you, Clerk Zhao. You've been awesome. Let me finish. All right. Oh dang, we've got we've got food and more stuff. Uh, let me see. Um. Where is it that we need to do? New equilibrium. Let's navigate here. Look for the guide to the Jade Chamber. There's so much going on, guys. There's so much going on. Here, before I get up there, why don't I boost some of my characters so that I can do the things? Okay, real quick, real quick, I'm gonna do this. Um, hmm, firstly, details refine, pop, pop, refine. Yay! My goal is to have just a bunch of maxed out weapons, which I don't think is actually going to be that hard. That wasn't all I wanted to do. Here, details, enhance, auto add. Do two star materials. Make sure there's nothing here that I want to keep. Great. Here. There we go. Oh, we are so close! Dang it! Like one more, one more, um, one star artifact, and then we are perfectly fine there. Um.
this over here? Oh, we use this to get up there, don't we? Okay, Buyun? According to Kuching, this is what we should say. Excuse me, do you sell the moon here? <laughs> That's clever. Yes. How many would you like? It's not convenient to speak of numbers here. Ah, well said. <laughs> Please, use this to ascend to the chamber. Uh, yes, speaking <laughs> of which, are you two the guests that Lady Ningguang has arranged to meet with today? Yes, we yeah. are. Yes, we are. And yet the code they used was not the one for guests, but for the Yuang. What's going on here? Um, I guess we were given an interesting code. If Ganyu had given us the correct code, we would have used the correct code. <gasps> we're up. <gasps> Lady Ningguang! She's very pretty. I've been waiting for you, returnee from Joyen Karst. Mm -hmm. uh, it's Ningguang! Since this is our first meeting, um, we've prepared a gift. I hope you like it. Oh, for me. You have my thanks. <laughs> it seems that I have made things difficult for you, considering that you were supposed to be my guests. Uh, it's no big deal. <laughs> oh no, it's nothing. This palace floats in the skies, higher than the peak of any mountain. From this vantage point, one may survey all of Liyue. Well, thank you. I have you been for gathering the funds here. necessary to build it from the time I began learning the merchant's craft. And since becoming the Tianchuan, I have spared no effort in hiring the best craftsmen to constantly extend it. It's beautiful. <laughs> At first, it was but the size of one room. Now, it is large enough to blot out the moon in the skies above Liyue. <laughs> one day, I believe it will overshadow all seven nations. Um, I don't think that is a um, practical nor a truly desirable goal. However... You do have Not ambition. many from outside Liyue earn the right to ascend to the Jade Chamber. But I have been in correspondence with the acting Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius, who spoke oh. highly of you. Oh, well, Jean is awesome too. As such, I have been putting eyes and ears out ever since you reached Liyue. Really? So you've had your right. eye on us? And I finally got wind of your movements when you were on the way to Wangshu Inn. Okay. Uh Wait, was Vergoldet one of your people? <laughs> Just Vergoldet? No, everyone at Wangshu Inn is one of ours. Wow, that's a very ominous uh, angle that they've got there. I don't fully trust this person anymore. <laughs> hmm. At the Guizhang Ballista, yes? Mm -hmm. uh, you weren't peeking on us from the skies the whole time, were you? <laughs> I wouldn't put it past her. <laughs> I fear that peeking would have been a little difficult from this altitude. Watching, then. Our eyes and ears are more than sufficient. You two are very interesting people, after all. It would be natural to take an interest. <laughs> well, I wouldn't expect you to trust us, considering that you have had far more interactions with the Adepti. Mm -hmm. This is... This the reason I invited fair. you here this was to clear statement. up some misunderstandings. Okay. Can't say I'll believe you, but I'll listen. A. More achievements. Yo. Hey. All right. I assume we're just gonna look down a leeway from here. I believe that you've heard of the Archon War. Um. Rings many of gods used to walk this earth, and many long wars were fought between them that did not abate until 2,000 years ago. Okay. Much blood was shed, and many lives were lost. In the end, only seven victors remained standing in Tevat. Oh, they built cities the and nations on the corpses of the vanquished, and thus began the era of the seven. Okay. You can see Goyun Stone Forest from here, I trust. It is no natural rock formation. Mm -hmm. Those are giant spears of rock hurled by Rex Lapis during the war. Goyan Forest. Beneath the spears lie uh. those cast down by Rex Lapis in those days. 
Gods that failed to seize the title of Archon. Hmm. Not only is it true that gods may die, but so too has the membership of the Seven changed over the last two millennia. Has it now? Rex Lapis's passing is an unimaginable disaster for Liyue. But the Order of the Seven will not collapse simply because of that. Well, then who's going to take his place as one of the Seven? Another Lord of Geo will arise sooner or later. Yet, how are we to forget Rex Lapis? When that time comes, the relationship between the people of Liyue and the gods and Adepti will surely be different from before. Makes sense. I mean, could I possibly become an Adeptus? Even in a new era, the Liyue Chi-Sing remain Rex Lapis's former subjects. Do you really think us capable of having played a part in his demise? Of lacking the foresight to see the certain repercussions? That is a fair statement, again. <laughs> That day at Yujing Terrace, it was also very sudden. Even I was caught completely off guard. You were there. You no doubt saw. Yeah, understood. And, yeah. But our enemy has long lain hidden within the harbor. If we do not act against them now, they will surely gain the upper hand. You see, whoever did this is buried beneath the spears. Hiding or the they Exuvia was a necessary the maneuver to take the initiative back. To play the spider while our foes scurry about. To make you think you have more of a plan than you actually do. But who's this enemy you're talking about? What do you think, Traveler? Him. Huh? What are you two talking about? The prince. Well answered. Uh, uh huh? <sighs> the scenery out here is fine indeed. But the wind is a little strong. Our preparations to receive the guests prince. within are complete. So please, this way. The one who has been controlling the Fatui as well. Our brother. We are the princess. There was there was a, a stone like a marker on, on Dragon Spine that I saw. Off stream, of course. It talk it speaks of the princess. And since we know that the prince has been controlling the Fatui. Then, here we go. I love how Paimon is just confused all the time. Paimon has two moods, confused Wally. and hungry. What a huge haul. Can I steal book pages? Can I steal pages of books, please? May I take the book pages? Oh, is this what we brought? It is what we brought. Ooh. I'm looking around. I'm just kind of looking around. I want to steal book pages, guys. I need to complete my collection. Emergency food. This is beautiful here. Okay, Ningguang, tell us more. Be at ease, you two. Make yourselves at home if you wish. I appreciate it, I appreciate it. Can we really? Paimon. Paimon, you know, you know, it does not mean what you probably think it means. Calm down. I have invited you two here as friends. And when friends come over to play, our enjoyment comes first. Naturally. Okay. Whoa. What is it? Isn't this that legendary wall? Um, let me take a look at this. Oh, Why, you've kept your ear to the ground, I see. Beautiful. It's a, it's a little, it's a, it's less of a conspiracy wall than I thought it would be. That's because even the storytellers are talking about it. Mm -hmm. Everyone's after a piece of paper from that wall. It's super famous. <laughs> That's because that wall records Leo's secrets. Merchants have always been attracted to secrets. Uh, yeah, it makes sense. But the secrets of the mercantile world are of no interest to you, are they, Traveler? <laughs> you're rather special, really, and I think you're quite aware of that. I mean, I'm trying to be. If possible, I'd like to have your trust. I can't guarantee I can give you that. But if you were to choose the more trustworthy person between myself and Kuching... <laughs> <laughs> You'd pick Kuching? 
Nah, I had a feeling. I don't really, but I mean, I what I would have said does not exist among those two. With someone of her character on the Chising, I've had some extra messes to clean up behind the scenes. <laughs> I can't imagine but why. After she said those words, the time of the Adepti has long passed. If even the Liyue Chising don't want to face that truth, then what future is there for Liyue? I don't trust this girl. I will well, say that. I must say that quite a few of my doubts have been dispelled. I won't deny that Rex Lapis's passing seems advantageous to us. But, for Liyue's sake, we cannot allow ourselves to be shackled by rumors of our usurpation of power. That is a good point. I don't have any reason to trust the Fatui. Indeed. It seems that you understood what I meant to say from the very beginning. I called for the gag order and for the Exuvia to be hidden to temporarily stabilize the situation, and also to prevent something similar to the incident in Mondstadt. Oh, you know about that. With Rex Lapis's death, the Fatui have busied themselves with many clandestine actions beyond their diplomatic remit. <laughs> As the Tianchuan, one responsible for Liyue, I cannot be too concerned with appearances when opposing them. This is, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Allowing the rite of parting to take place was also meant to buy some time for us to take control of Liyue's administration. <sighs> it's exactly as Zhongli said. The Qixing only provided the venue for the right, so they could use us for their own ends. <laughs> Wait, that's right. Speaking of ends, could I say one other thing? That's the first time that I've that we've heard Paimon say I that I that I can remember. She usually goes, could Paimon say one other thing? Of course. Paimon's heard that anyone who sends a greeting gift Paimon. gets a something in return. So, does that include us? Paimon. Shush! <laughs> it's alright. I like direct people. Yeah. Well, we have made quite a bit of trouble for you recently. How about this? You can pick any one object here as you please. And you may take it with you. Uh, in that case, books. Yay! Paimon was just waiting for you to say that! Let's see, what should we get? <gasps> One of the sheets on that wall! Don't look at Paimon like that! Oh One my of these gosh. sheets of paper will sell for crazy prices, even if it's only as large as Paimon's fingernail! Just imagine, how much more a whole untorn sheet would sell for! Paimon. Let's grab one! The biggest one! Paimon, you are insane. I'm I'm quickly going to do this and, and grab the and grab the, the things. I love the music for this place. It's beautiful. Let's see. What's here? Huh? Well that was an easy search. The biggest Another sheet is mood. right up there in the most obvious spot. Let's go with that one. No. <gasps> la, 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 la. Let's see what's written on it. Huh? There's a place marked with a circle on here. Hmm. Oh, could it be treasure? Whatever it is, it better make us filthy rich. Let's see what's written over here. I'm on why. Sigil of permission, something, something, fatui, research, copy. Huh? Aw, oh, that doesn't sound like treasure at all. No, there's more to this. Oh my gosh, <gasps> Paimon, you're going this to give me an ulcer. This shows that a Qixing spy discovered traces of classified Fatui research on the sigil of permission. Wait, what? Oh, Ningguang did say that the Fatui have been up to all kinds of mischief in the shadows of Liyue. Huh. Spreading rumors, wanting to get their hands on the Archon's body and whatnot. Okay, so I have... A sigil of permission. But research on the sigil of permission? Paimon wonders what they're up to. Speaking of which, there's also some connection between you and the sigil of permission. Seems there's still hmm. more for us to find out. Oh. True. You really think so? You appreciate direct people, Ningguang. Why don't you be direct with us? If you really want us to go there. Well, should we not go then? No, we're gonna go there. Oh, so you're saying that it's precisely because we can't completely trust Ningguang that we should confirm the truth of what she says for ourselves. I mean, that wasn't what I was thinking. I was simply following what I was... what my instincts told me the story wanted me to do, but also... Mm. You're right. 
That's way out of Paimon's league. Paimon thinks she's been nothing but good to us. Anyway, you said it, not me. Let's see if you're onto something. Um, before we look for Zhongli at Dihua Marsh, let's go to the place marked out on these papers and see if the Fatui really are up to no good there. I guess we better. All right, let's look around the jade the jade room first. Uh... This is beautiful. Ningguang seems to be the most in the know about my situation, even though we haven't told her much. Alright. chests, nothing there. Oh yeah, we've got, what was it? What was it that we were given? This stuff! Delicious looking. I kind of want to eat crab now. Da, 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 da. Um, actually, let's not work on her. Let's work on Bennett, like we said. Benny's adventure team Hey, assemble. Benny! Five, six, confirm. Hmm, or not. Confirm. Ringo Amo tends to this <laughs> yeah, understood. Confirm. Oh, ow. Where did that come from? Hey, Benny's up to level forty now. What does it take to ascend Benny? We need two of these. La -da -da. Boom. Confirm. So our people are leveled up. Hey, um, Zeno TTV, thank you so much for following. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, uh, let's go to the thingy. Welcome, welcome. And then it turns into Oh my gosh. Actually scared me. Okay. Oh, I think this is where we're supposed to go, isn't it? Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, I love Genshin. It's great. Crisp. Hello, sir. Um. <laughs> We're gonna do this. Yes. Please, 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 please. Right, there. Okay. Let it rain. I didn't mean to do that, but okay. <sighs> Don't hit Amber. Are you kidding me? My man. Freeze. Don't get frostbite. You seem to have a weakness when it comes to ice. And the other person has a weakness when it comes to fire. Dodge this. How can I deal with this? How can I do this? Chill to the bone. 
See, I don't know if this is what actually happens or not, but I feel like it makes sense for um, um, a lot of our key, like, or if Kaya is a is a cryo, to him for him to take less cryo damage. But I don't think that's how it works. Go. And then I'm gonna wait until he stops there, and then I'm gonna go like this. And of course, he moves out of the way. Woo! Hello. This is okay though. This is fine. Oh, you know what's even better? She has a shield. She has a shield. It's time for the flash freeze. Oh, dang it. Hard. There we go. Try to get Zhongli, we got Mona and Sidelast Banner. Got it. Understood. Flash Frost. I really need to level up Amber some. She's got like the best weapon that I've that I've got is her bow. It's frustrating. And you're gone. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, well, um. I think I need, I need to grab around here. No, uh, let's do this. Can I? Huh? What did that do? I have no clue. If I go up this way? Oh, there's more people I need to fight. Never mind. Well, crap. Come on. Be gone. This should be fun. Saving up primos. Nice, nice. I have not been saving my primos and I should have been. Alright, this guy's a hydro, so Freeze. best person for this is of course Kaya. What's the hurry? Oh, so sorry. Freeze. Here we go. We just, we just keep hitting him. It's kind of like freeze time around him or something. That's kind of cool. Because he does this teleportation thingy. That's kind of it's kind of crazy. Anything? No. Um, Noel is a good one for this. As a good night show. this today I didn't want this today all right oh, I guess Freeze. we're just gonna deal with it oh it's okay it's not it's not like a level 40 times in my time. Thankfully, I have some experience. Where is he? Where is he? 
But this moment will be frozen in time. It's already half done. Those Tillatrols up there would stop doing that. Let it rain. Oh my, I am being blinded by flowers. Stop that. Dodge this. Please. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Blinded by flowers. Blinded by flowers. Leave me alone. What's the coolant? There we go. Ha ha! How fortunate. And I'm walking. Stop that. Oh, that's something new. <laughs> What's Twin nephrite. Oh, it's one of those things that um, the mages use. From Razor Main to a Zhao Main. Nice. Okay, so let's head up here. Hi, sir. Goodbye, sir. Windblade. That does a lot of damage. I love it. Strategy, ladies and gents. Strategy. Derpy Taco! Taco, thank you so much for the for the 1,000. For the 1,000 bits. Oh my gosh. I appreciate it. Okay. I must leave no stone unturned. Where are you? Where are you? Hi. Goodbye. Kaya has some incredible damage because he has the Berserker set. Huh? Can't even see anything, but he is dead. Alright. Uh, so let's figure out here what we we're supposed to do. Supposed to get down there. Animo, obviously. Let's figure out the puzzle. Oh, hey. Here's a second one. Are they both on now? Dang. Dang, okay. So we've got two. A. Yep, yep, you did. Yep, yep. Dodge this. Fascinating. Okay. Um. Is there? Oh, there's a lot of hidden stuff down here. Fascinating. Nice. Good stuff, good stuff.
was... So we've got an Animo thing there, an Animo thing there. I feel like there should be a third one? A second or a third one? Uh, a third or a third and a fourth, maybe. That's what I meant. Sorry. Obviously. Oh. Hi. That's new. Here. What's in and there that they need? Blank paper too. Huh. Hmm. What are they for? Um. I haven't seen this pattern before. It's on the sigil but of protection, isn't it? Where? Oh, Paimon knows. It oh, looks permission. Just like the sigil of permission the child gave you. Wait a second. Did we get a counterfeit sigil? Hmm. But how did a relic of the adept die end up in or is the he trying to protect it? Like child? Oh, that's right. Cloud Retainer said that when the Lord of Geo created the sigil oh. of permission, it wasn't to be used as some old relic. Uh-huh. Housemans like that were once used in the Archon War to oh, channel divine power. Oh, so that's what they're doing. Maybe the Fatui are copying the sigil of permission in hopes of achieving a similar effect. That makes Being sense. Being able to channel divine power in battle? That sounds really Ooh, dangerous, yeah. That sounds pretty dangerous. Ooh, the, the Fatui are ambitious. Mm -hmm. And the plot thickens. We we'll need to keep an eye on child, that's for sure. Yeah, that's really dangerous. Mm. All right, that's enough sticking around here. We gotta go meet up with Zhang Li soon. Yep. The last stop on our ride of parting preparations tour is Dihua Marsh. Let's go. Paimon hates being late. Do you? <laughs> All right. See, before we go, I want to see if there's anything I can do here with this thing. Where is... Obviously, we're missing something. Obviously, we're missing something. Paimon just hungry. <laughs> Makes sense. Okay, so let's do this. And then we go down here. Obviously... I, f oh, I feel like we've got to get them both at once, right? We've got to get them both. But in order to do to get them both, we've got to be super fast. There we go. Got it. A reward on the road. Nice. Okay. Uh, let me quickly grab this. And yeah, I haven't seen these things. Skirmisher. Interesting. I'm pretty sure. No, I don't have any new achievements. That's fine. That's fine. Um. Let's go to our map. We've got to go to Dihua Marsh. Marsh. So let's um head to Luhua Pool. And there's stuff at Luhua that I haven't done yet too. It's interesting. Da, 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 da. Oh, hello. We stay away from him. We stay away, away from him. Here we go. So used to the traveler not talking, it feels weird. <laughs> talking about me talking. Reward on the road. It's the thing I hear say most. Right on time. I myself only arrived moments ago. Did mm -hmm. you enjoy your visit to the Jade Chamber? It was really interesting. It was so big and pretty and expensive. Calm down, I have never seen such a fancy schmancy place before. <laughs> Indeed. It's second to none in all of Liyue. 
This is very true. Then you met with Ningguang, I trust? What did you talk about with her? Mm, just the plans, I guess. She's super rich and so generous. <sighs> Paimon thinks she's very friendly. This is also true. Business people are always friendly when it suits their yeah, interests. Yeah, her take on Ningguang is quite different from Paimon's. She thinks that even the tactless Yuhang is more trustworthy than her. I said that in the presence of Ningguang for the sake of not showing my hands, oh. let's say it that way. So you also met with Kuching then. What did she have to say? Sounds like you know her. She said, the time of the Adepti has long passed. If even the Liu and Qixing don't want mm -hmm. to face that truth, then what future is there for Liu? <laughs> no respect for the divine. None at all. Indeed, contrary to the Everbold Kuching, Ningguang is more of a businesswoman at heart. Though they are both members of the Qixing. I mean, it takes many different people to create a balanced view. Although she's friendly, there's no way of clearly discerning her true intentions. <laughs> yes, she has only relied on herself to rise to her current position. No ordinary <laughs> person could ever achieve that. This is true. It's said she that she's the one special. behind the constant expansion of the Jade Chamber. It's the second most important thing to her. Even if she ever gave up the position of Tian Xuan, she would never give up the Jade Chamber. <laughs> What's the most important thing the to Jade her? The Jade Chamber is only second. What's the most important thing to her then? Why, Mora, of course. Money. All Ningguang talked about was the Fatui this and the Fatui that. She said that after Rex Lapis was murdered, the Fatui have constantly been trying to sink their fingers into Liyue and that they aren't to be trusted. I mean, that does make sense. From her point of view, it's, it's the, and also the Fatui have proven that they are not trustworthy. That is how the Fatui have always been. It doesn't surprise me in the least. Yeah. Hmm. No matter what they may be planning, you must be careful when dealing with the Fatui. Always be on your guard. No matter how charming they are. So, is there anything we need to get for the Rite of Parting in Diwal Marsh? Yes, as a matter of fact, there is. Today, we'll be gathering wild glaze lilies. Oh, I've got plenty of those. Glaze lilies? But why did we come all the way out here? Doesn't the garden in Yujing Terrace have some? Even Qingsa Village has glaze lilies. Oh, right! Paima remembers that Madame Ping is always tending to flowers. Maybe we could ask her. No. Those lilies have all been gardened by people. They won't do at all. Understood. Dihua Marsh used to be full of glaze lilies. It is a sort of joyful flower that listens to human song. Yeah, I remember. Before the Arkhan War, Dihua Marsh was all dry land and fertile soil. But the war caused landslides, and the land was flooded, turning it into the marsh you see now. Nearly all the glazed lilies were wiped out. Hmm. Of course, there are some kinds of flowers that have been preserved and gardened by people in the city. But very few people know that glazed lilies may still be found in the wild. Mm, we need the wild, wild ones, because it's like have the strongest fragrance. before the war. If we want to follow the true tradition of the rite of parting, we must grind up the wild lilies and place the powder in a censer of everlasting incense. Okay. But I'll need your assistance in gathering these <laughs> flowers. Okay, well, I can do that. Um, no, I need you to sing, sing to them. Sing to them? Singing to the flowers will make them more fragrant. Interesting. Ah, uh, so how good is your singing? I mean, not to brag, but... Really? Why doesn't Paimon believe you? Because <laughs> Paimon's we'll an idiot. We'll only know once she starts singing. Mm -hmm. I've been singing this whole time. I didn't know this thing. Really angry. Is it because you sang a song 
Uh, that's possible. Are these glaze lilies? Are these like actually no nice lilies? My sight. These look like um something that I've encountered before, and not lilies. Uh, not so oh, hard. Uh. Come on, let me out. Humor good hits. Ow, ow, I'm getting pummeled. I'll get over here. There we go. One down. It does not. Okay, stop. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. You, my good friend, need to calm the heck down. Let just just yeah. leave me alone. Ooh. Hey, I don't. Thanks for the woo. Okay. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Wind blade. There we go. Ha, oh, that's taken care of. Those weren't glaze lilies. Glaze lilies wouldn't hit people. Uh-huh, that was... I don't like uh, dealing with more than one at once. This little monster is known as a whopper flower. I have encountered them before. Hmm. Strange. These petals look interesting. How so? The glaze lilies used as a disguise were buried with the whopper flower for too long. The result seems to have surprisingly potent medicinal value. Huh. Let's collect what we can of these petals. Okay. Well, that's nice and all, but will those petals be useful for the rite of parting? Unfortunately, no. All right, let's find them then. Ugh, that's so lame. Excuse me. Ganyu, are you searching for glaze lilies? Hello, Traveler. I'm surprised you still remember my name. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me. How was your visit to the Jade Chamber? Pretty well, good. it sure would have been better if you told us how to get up there. Oh, Didn't yeah. I tell you the way? Surely I did. Nope. Sorry, Ganyu. Nope. We found the way on our own. Oh, I see. <laughs> Uh-oh. I guess I really did forget to tell them. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor Ganyu. Seems a little off about Ganyu. Yeah, what's going on there? She's acting different from the first time we met. Where's her serious attitude now? Oh, well, I met you at that time as an emissary of the Tianquan. But now, I am simply out on a stroll to see the flowers. Oh, that's nice. You came all the way out here to see the flowers? Why not just enjoy the gardens of the city? <sighs> Yujing Terrace is where Rex Lapis parted from this world. If I strolled through those lonely gardens now, I wouldn't be able to bear it. Sound like you have a respect for him. Whenever my duties take me near Yujing Terrace these days, I draw the windows to block my view of the gardens. Mm. Oh, sorry. We shouldn't have brought it up. Sounds like Ganyu no, has a great respect. it's quite all right. I just haven't processed my emotions yet. Understood. When the Archon War came to its end 2,000 years ago, the first iteration of the Seven would gather in Liyue and drink with Rex Lapis. Emotional but five of those damage. original Seven had already passed before Rex Lapis. It's truly a changing of the guard. There are only yes. two left. Now that the spirit of Rex Lapis has returned to the heavens, Wait. only Barbados of Mondstadt remains of the first Seven. Wow. The other five, including Inazuma's Raiden Shogun, are no longer the same friends from 2,000 years ago. <laughs> of the current Seven Archons, the youngest is Sumeru's god of Dendro. She is merely 500 years old, whereas Rex Lapis was more than 6,000 years old at the time of his passing. Wow. I wonder who's going to become the next Geo Archon. Will it be Zhongli, possibly? This means that Liyue had been under Rex Lapis's rule from the moment it was first founded 3,700 years ago. 
the city has never had to bid farewell to its deity. <laughs> so what do you think of this... farewell? Huh? This... This is a little sudden, I... <sighs> As a mortal, I've never dared to imagine a Liyue without Rex Lapis. Mm -hmm. But as an Adeptus, I think I will eventually come to grips with reality. Wait, she's an Adeptus? Since Rex Lapis has passed, the time of Liyue's contract with the gods and Adepti has now reached its end. Huh? Did you just say, as an Adeptus? Yes, I... I am a mix of human and Chilean. Adeptus blood flows through wow. my veins. I fought for Rex Lapis and the city of Liyue during the Archon War. Wow. After the war ended, I signed a contract with Rex Lapis and took the position as secretary for the Chising. I've continued those duties to this very day. Yeah, that does explain the horns. Well, uh, let's save that conversation <laughs> for another day. You say that you are here looking for glaze lilies? Yeah. I also know where wild glaze lilies can be found. See, I've just picked one myself. Here. You may have it if you wish. Wow. You were here when glaze lilies grew here before. <laughs> we dare not refuse it. Thank you. Oh, so did you sing a song before you picked the lily? Indeed, I did. I know this tradition well. In fact, I sang can a local Leo and added to it. Wow, so you really know your stuff, too. Thanks, Gunyu. No, it is you who I should be thanking. If not for this chance meeting, I never thought that I would be able to contribute mm -hmm. to the upcoming farewell for our ancient lord. Yeah, that must be really if hard. If you would excuse me, I should return to my work now. Good luck. Thank you, Ganyu. And that just about does it. Our preparations for the rite of parting are mostly finished. All right, Given what else do we need? Given the ease of picking glaze lilies, I think this was a fitting end to our tasks, in more ways than one. <laughs> yeah, Paimon can already imagine him starting a business in Liyue. Yeah, why don't you do something? <laughs> I've had enough ventures in my life already. Beginning a new undertaking is always difficult at first, and requires no small amount of effort. That is true. And once business is at full steam, the stress of it all only wears away at you over time, so you must be careful to take the time to step back and re-examine yourself. <laughs> if left unchecked, the wear and tear on your heart may go well past mending. Mm, wow. That's true. See, Jolly sounds like he's already seen it all. I mean, that would explain the, the all right. stuff. I think it's about time we head back the, to the, the, the knowledge. All right. La -la -la. <laughs> Okay, um, firstly, let me take care of this little thing right here, um, gonna go like this, refine, grab, boom, define, refine to rank 3, confirm, go back, and now here we go, we've got this interesting thing, we're gonna go details, and haunts, going to go three star materials and un wait auto add we're going to enhance confirm level 20 boom look at that so easy i love it i love it okay um is there anything else here oh we've got a few a few little things here and there I need a three-star one of these. <laughs> it's annoying me so much. Let me see. We're going to go details, enhance, and then we're going to go like this. And that is the... Our, um... This one is now completely leveled up. Which means that, mo that Kaya's stuff is now very, very high. It's good. It's good. Let's do this. Go details. Enhance. Yo, okay. Confirm. Back. 
Yeah. I've just been trying to level up Kaya's stuff lately because there's so, um... Because he's my second, everything from, from my, my, from the Traveler is already completely leveled up. And Kaya is like my second favorite thing to play as, favorite person to play as, so I've been trying to get his stuff up to speed. After that, I'm going to work on Amber, which her stuff isn't too bad. And then after that, I'll focus on Razor, I think. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Gonna teleport here just real quick. Just real quick. Hi. There we go. Firstly, let's get our health back. Now let me offer up my stuff. Worship the statue. Offer all. Noise, noise. Alright. So that's it. And I'm going to quickly. I want to test something really quick. I'm going to resonate with Geo. Um. Resonate with Geo. I don't really use my, my Geo stuff, but I do want to quickly do this. Because. Yeah! Here we go. Yeah, I haven't done anything, any of these. I haven't done any of these yet. In a souvenir shop. Interesting. Alright, um, well, let's, let's stay here for now, I guess. Alright. There we go. Teleport. Let's go. You're the consultant to Wongsheng Funeral Parlor. Mr. Zhongli, I presume. Yeah. The Millilith are watching our every move now. These are desperate times. We mustn't act rashly. Desperate times? The Adepti of Joyun Karst are finally on the move. Do are they intend they? to exercise force? Most likely. I've heard that some members of the Qixing have already gone to meet them. Oh, Though, no. I say meet, but it's more like they're attempting to stall right. the Adepti outside hour summit outside with the James. And you possibly... Possibly, we could try that. Um, I have to. I'd have to know when. I don't know if I can lately because I. Because I mean, you guys know I've been super, super busy lately. But if you guys have like a better sense of when, let me know. We'll see. However, both sides were quite obstinate and hit an impasse. It seems inevitable given hmm. the current situation. All right, Cookie. Thank you. Um, scenes inevitable given the current situation. Don't have a specific date, just, uh... Okay. Uh, yeah, uh, let me know if I can. I will. I can't make any promises right now, though. I'm a, everything's a bit up in the air. So, dang, it looks like there's gonna be a war between the gods and Liwei. The Adepti do not acknowledge the Chi Sing. They only acknowledge the contracts of the Geo Archon. I mean, that's if good the enough, isn't it? come to blows, Liyue Harbor will be in no position to stop them. Surely the Liu and Chi Sing are not the sort to give in so easily. Oh my gosh. Okay, got it. Good patch. Huh. Good. Their boneheadedness is known Dude, throughout uh, the lands. Dude, my one year anniversary is on November 7th. And the are now on the verge of conflict. So that might be a good time to do that, so we'll see. And what now? How is it that the Fatui have come under fire? Ah, that's all Ningguang's doing. 
She proclaimed oh, no. that in these tumultuous times, the Millilith must rein in the actions of the Fatui. I mean, the Fatui have been kind of acting quite outside there. Only their... now do they want to start keeping tabs on us? <laughs> That's the cheesing for you. Oh my gosh. Anyway, Mr. Zhongli, you're one of Child's close associates. Please understand that your actions will reflect on us. Don't let anyone catch you off guard. It looks like things are about to boil over in Liyue Harbor. Oh my gosh. Do you intend to use your neutral identity as an intermediary between I both could. sides? Or will you use your sword to turn the balance? Neither path is an easy one. No. Oh, by the way, Mr. Zhongli, we've heard that the Wangsheng Funeral Parlor has also been caught up in all of this. They're currently squaring off with the authorities at the gates. Oh, no. Things are taking a turn for the worse. I'm afraid I must leave now to handle things back at Wangsheng Funeral Parlor. I hope that Master Hu has been able to keep things under control for the moment. Oh, I hope so Consider too. I don't want Consider your next course of action carefully, Traveler. If you're trying to prevent an explosion, it may be wisest to look for the fuse first. <sighs> Having connections with the Fatui seems to be quite the double-edged sword. So what does Xiangli mean by looking for the fuse? Hmm. Child. Oh, Paimon gets it. If there's anyone that wants to see the whole city turned upside down, it's definitely him. I don't know that he wants that, but he definitely has reason to see it as advantageous. He must be waiting for the moment when no one is watching to do something really bad. But where could we find him now? Where would he go at a time like this? I don't know where he is, but here, let's find out. Guys, look at that. Wait, what teleport waypoint? <gasps> the stone forest! You can go to the stone forest now, guys. Da -da I won't do it yet, though. Who is it that's... no. Hey, wait a second, what is... The golden house was head up there. Dang. Here, let's use these real quick. Gone to send any of these. I'm not interested in Lisa. I've already got a full set for Barbara and it's kind of OP. So. As soon as I can get her to a point where I can use her, I'm going to use her. Oh wait, there's a way up a little further. Here. Just make things easier for myself. Teleport. Gonna have the distance. Halve. That's a weird word. I've never thought about that. Have. H-A-L-V-E. We just wanted to have a little funeral for the Geoarchon. We just wanted a funeral, guys. And now everything's gone wrong. Have I been here before? 
I don't think I've been here before, guys. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Um, so this is a domain. Um, we want you. Wait, 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 wait. Um, possible rewards. Monsterless child. What? Uh, excuse me. Does it give me a recommended? Noel level forty. Razor level forty. Okay, well I'll you know what. Your back. Uh, let's go. Wow! This is the golden house? It's beautiful. It looked impressive enough from the outside, but who would have guessed that it was even fancier on the inside? What is the type that you can, can't get rid of so Alvin's- Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is where all of Tabat's Mora is minted, right? In that case, maybe they won't notice if a few more go missing. Oh, so it's a trap! Tricky, tricky. Good thing Paimon's got you here. Paimon, you have no but conscience. Even if we can't take any, when it comes we to can greed, still have a closer look, right? Or better You're yet, take a nap on top of a mountain of Mora. It's like a dream come true. Oh, right. Back to business. It's quiet. Too quiet. It's really. It is. Is making me nervous. This is beautiful, though. As important as the Exuvia. Huh? Look. What happened here? Uh oh. Uh oh. trouble. Quick, we have to go make sure that the Exuvia is all right. Oh, that's the Exuvia. That's rather um grotesque. Why does it feel like the moment we get close to it, something's gonna go extremely wrong? As long as they're not dead. As long as the people around are not dead. Whew. You've already fulfilled your task as guides, so why do you still linger here? Child. Haven't you already seen enough trouble for today? If you were Fatui, I imagine that you would be entitled to a generous reward from the Tsaritsa herself. But now, you're nothing but dross, and you're in my way. <laughs> my gosh. Although I'm deeply grateful to you that I was able to effortlessly find this secret location, don't you think that trying to stop me now would just be wasted effort? Mm, no. Stopping the more immense, hiding away the Exuvia. <laughs> The Chising are really pulling out all the stops this time. Child, you so you've are been crazy. planning to take the Gnosis from inside the Exuvia all along? <laughs> As one of the eleven Fatui Makes sense. I should have thought of that. It's my duty to see the will of the Tsaritsa fulfilled. She will get that which she desires. <laughs> I'm not asking for your blessing, and there's nothing you can do to stop me anyway. Well, now we know what they're what they're after every single time is 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 the Gnosis. I didn't even think about the Gnosis until just now. The time for discussion and diplomacy has already passed. I mean, if it were up to me, I would have skipped that stage to begin with. But I'm willing to do as the Tsaritsa deems fit. Okay, so you being charismatic Either was way, literally just a trap. We the now come time. to my favorite part. A simple pleasure, and one that I am oh so delighted to be sharing with you. The battle. Battle? Okay. So you're the type that goes looking for trouble, huh? <laughs> You Stop. Could say okay, that. for someone who says they dislike discussion, you're talking a lot. Can we just fight? When Senora offended the deities outside the cathedral in Mondstadt. She swiftly I don't, left the scene I once don't her mission was accomplished. I don't need the villain monologue. I really Instead don't. Instead of confronting you directly, she chose to rely on the snow and ice to make her escape. Mm -hmm. She wouldn't want the night when she faces a worthy opponent. She will prioritize her mission. I don't the need outcomes. it. But as for me. The greatest pleasure of being a harbinger lies in crossing blades with strong opponents. Huh. We won't let what happened in Mondstadt ever happen again! Oh, I have a feeling we're gonna fail. So you intend to fight me? Good. I won't kill you, Traveler. 
I'll just play along to feel the thrill of battle. Besides, you could never defeat me, not even in your wildest dreams. But hey, try to you relish have no the fight idea. anyway. You have no idea because what you're dealing you with, man. Me, with <laughs> Fighting talk, I love it. Now let's see you live up to it. All right. This chance is hard to come by, so show me all you've got. So very few ever get the chance to square off with a Fatui Harbinger. So come now, amuse me, and don't you dare disappoint. Ooh, dang. Got me. He's an aqua wielder, right? He's a water. Isn't he? Or fire. Cool it. Oh, dang. Don't get frostbite. What's the hurry? There we go. Opportunity. He sure doesn't stay down long, does he? It's fast. What's the freeze? Poor passable effort. He's a bow wielder. That's right, I'm not. I am currently not Animo, which is regrettable. Because Animo is my favorite. Poor timing. And it's the one I'm most comfortable in, and the one I know how to deal with best. That's gorgeous. How the heck is that a thing? Passable left. What's the hurry? Bet you can't keep up, let it rain. This is actually a lot less difficult than it should be. Which is um Try this. It's making me nervous that this is feeling so easy. Cowering already? Dodge this. This moment will be frozen in time. Not Don't bad, push your luck. Not bad. Okay. Not bad. You've got a trick. <laughs> Good. No wonder Senora was so wary of you. Well, that just means I can go all out. Whoa, multi, multi elements. This is about to get tough. Now, show me what you can do against the might of a harbinger. Got you. No, you didn't. We're good. We're good. Ow. He's everywhere. Oh my gosh. He's everywhere. Freeze. Don't push your luck. No use hiding back there. Got you. All you do is run. I mean, yeah, it seems the reasonable option, kid. Free to push your luck. I'm gonna have to stop and, and uh, heal some of my characters in a second. Don't push your luck. Oh, yikes. Uh, this is what I meant. Just stop and heal. Oh, dang it, I only have three. Um, hopefully that's enough. <laughs> no use hiding back there. Got you. Come on, my friend. Cool it. Calm down. Don't get frostbite. <laughs> Starfall. I'll crush you. There we go. Okay. Not bad. Your swordsmanship is quite impressive. But 
That's about as far as you'll get. <laughs> Yay, I am Animo. Angio. <laughs> Didn't think you had that card hidden up your sleeve. You were just playing us to get close to the Exuvia! Oh, quiet down. Stop acting like some wide-eyed recruit. You've seen this world. You of all people should know. My this god. Expected. <laughs> well then, I'll be taking Morax's gnosis now. <laughs> I see. Well, this is most unexpected. Oh, you, no. You beat me to it, didn't you? <laughs> He's water and lightning. <gasps> oh, crap. Uh, we don't have to fight him, do we? We don't have to fight him in this form, do we? Artaglia. Not that. But this is going to cost you. Oh no. Oh no. Please don't tell me I have, I have to face off against him. Please tell me. No. No, 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 we didn't take it! Who did then? Ah! Oh, crap! I am genuinely terrified right now. Oh, dang. What's the He is both ice and water. I think Kaya is my best bet. Yep. But that means that I've got to be quick. To the dodge. Find his patterns. Find his patterns. What's the hurry? Okay. Okay. Letting his, him kind of just do his thing for a little bit, just running in a circle. I'm trying to understand how he how he strikes. There we go. Woo! There we go. That was a good one. Freeze. Dang. There we go. There we go. Dodge this. Kai is my best bet. If I can if I can just continue to dodge. Don't push your luck. Oh, that was not a dodge, guys. <laughs> That was not a dodge. Cool it. This moment will be frozen in time. Kai is gonna. Just, I'm, just, I'm just sacrificing Kai. Here. Die here. No. Well, I guess it did. Was dang. Unexpected. Get up behind him. Oh. Okay. 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 I can do this from a distance, thankfully, but Amber. Okay. I might lose all four characters, guys. 
I am already so close to losing two. Bet you can't keep up with me. No escape. <laughs> Bet you can't keep up there with me. There we go. Me. Okay. I need to run, I need to run, I need to run. Okay. No, 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 no. You stay over there. Die here. Nope. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, weird. Why did I stop? I had my finger on the wrong button. Oh, it's taking it down just degrees at a time. He's taking it down though. Slowly. Bet you can't keep up with me. Um, uh, well so far he can't, which is good. Oh dang. Bet you can't keep up with me. Things are making that aim a little bit easier for me. It, we're taking the health bar down just just tiny little bits at a time tiny little bits I hate it so much let's try you oh, uh. Get back. okay Not, it's definitely not going to give us as much. Um. Woo! Hello. Oh crap. Oh, dang. Razor's gone. No. Oh no. Oh no, guys, we're not doing too hot. The edge, get to the edge, get to the edge. Okay. <laughs> Guys, we are not doing hot at all right now. I really, really wish that I had gotten back and made the traveler animo again. can continue to dodge and just use Amber's bow, this is how I excel against incredibly OP opponents. This is this is the best way that I know to take down opponents. Okay. Okay. But if he hits me bad once or twice more, I will not be. Not be doing okay. I'll race you there. Okay, I've got a strategy. I've got a strategy. Um, this is all I know to do. Firstly, eat that. Use that. Um, use these. Wait. Crit rate. I'll use that. Um, and I'm going to use these here. And first thing, I'm going to revive Kaya. He is not going to have much health, but it's going to keep me from just like losing all of my characters when I'm in here. 
bet you can't um, keep up with me. Might give me some time. Bet you can't keep up with me. <laughs> so Amber dies, which we are still okay. We're not doing great, but we're all right. Um. There we go. You can't keep up with me. Him teleporting close to me really does help. That scared me. <laughs> Thanks, Pengu. I'm gonna get to the edge here. See his heavy hits take up the entire arena except the edge. Why did I ever find this guy in any way charismatic? Ah! Dang, that was 400... 450 damage points. We're getting close, guys. We're getting close. Not much longer. Oh, that was a hard hit. How did that do no damage to me? I don't understand. We're so close. Oh, he's doing his thing. We're close, guys. We're close. If I can get one more direct hit... Bet you or two... Keep up with me. Cool off. It seems the burden of the foul legacy transformation was too great for my body. I lacked the opportunity to think this through. Or you just didn't think it through? <laughs> and now that I consider the matter more carefully, you never had any chance of beating me to the Gnosis. Mm-hmm. Exactly. This is this is You yeah. had no connection to the Gnosis, no matter where it had been taken. So who took it? That's what we've been trying to tell you. We didn't take it. Your show of ability today far surpasses that of Signora's initial assessment of you and Mondstadt. Yeah, I mean, Signora took Tell me the prize. How could that be? <laughs> you already know the answer, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. But if that is a secret you wish to keep, I guess I'll just have to curb my curiosity. This battle has already left me satisfied. Anyone who strives as I do to grow stronger shall be called a friend. Even if our friendship can only be shown in battle against one another. That is a very interesting viewpoint, child, and I don't think I agree, I'm but... sure that's not the normal way to make friends. You do you, man. You do you. Unfortunately, Just stay out of my way. I must bring this amiable conversation to an end. My quest still beckons. Given that the Gnosis wasn't taken <laughs> by anyone, then we must look once again to the beginning. Perhaps it was never in the Exuvia to begin with. And where is it? In fact... It might be that the Exuvia was just a diversion of sorts. Then where is it? What? So you mean that... Yes, it appears so. Huh. Interesting to say the least. I knew it, guys. I knew it. it I knew he wasn't dead. It seems the guardian deity of the capital of commerce is also well-versed in little maneuvers beyond the boundaries of contracts. <laughs> and as such, we must now look to our backup plan. Backup plan? I had hoped it would never come to this. For the weak will be swept away in the process. Child, the you truth crazy is, person. The world belongs to those who pursue strength. I seldom willingly involve myself with the weak. You're sounding an awful lot like Lord Voldemort. Unfortunately, we cannot be picky about our methods as Fatui Harbingers. Uh, I mean, Children you can. must all learn to eat their vegetables sometime. So what are you planning to do? 
I will awaken the god that lies dormant beneath Guyan's stone forest. Oh my gosh. Oh my no. Osile, overlord of the Vortex, who was defeated by Morax, the GR Archon, in the Archon War, and who has remained pinned beneath the waves by the GR Archon's stone spears ever since. I really if don't such think it's going to end well for you, child. such an ancient god would be unleashed upon Liyue Harbor, defenseless without the protection of its deity, do you think the cunning Rex Lapis would just stand aloof and watch the ensuing destruction? He won't. Like, the Archon War ended 2,000 years also, ago! Also, you're telling us How this. You know we're gonna stop you. How can an appear in a world now overseen by the Seven? Simple. I've already prepared the means to awaken it. Aha! Uh -huh. <gasps> Those are sigils of permission! Oh, Paimon remembers now. The Fatui have been researching them! Indeed. The one that was given to you was just a byproduct of our research. With the power of so many sigils of permission concentrated in one place, along with that which was bestowed upon me as a this harbinger by Tsaritsa, and it's not breaking the going subduing might of the GR well, Archon spears that for a time should be no explaining obstacle. explaining this to us, because now we know how to stop him, or know Using the how powers to research. of ancient gods in such a situation fails to interest me, and is largely against my principles. Uh, well, I... Don't think there is much that goes against but your principles that at this such point. such an action will not only force the Geo Archon to show its hand, but you as well. That makes matters a little more intriguing. Hmm. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Water spouts. I hate these things. They scare me. Tornadoes. <laughs> Let's see. Will oh, the wow, nation that has lost its deity be swallowed expensive. up by an ancient malice once more? If you wish to drown together with the people of Nia, you're free to stay and enjoy the show. <laughs> this is a lot more expressive than the other cutscenes we've seen. Huh? He's he's already gone. That guy is fast. <sighs> wow. What's going on? Flooding? Yo. Yo. Dude. This is insane. <sighs> oh, come on. If we hadn't happened to see the Jade Chamber flying over just as we came out of the Golden House, we really wouldn't have known which way to go. <sighs> Did we make it in time? Is the Overlord of the Vortex still in the sea? It hasn't destroyed Leila yet, has it? What are you doing here? Joe! Huh? Hold on! It's the Adept <gasps> Guy! It's all of them! on the Jade Chamber! Paimon thought you were arguing with the chi -Sing. Is the fighting over? Faced with a calamity of such magnitude, we have agreed to put our differences aside for I now. I knew she was an adept unite fight, against this common enemy. Teapot lady. <laughs> oh, Paimon gets it. So how do you plan to defend Leela? Eh, just seeing this overlord of the Vortex guy puts a pit in Paimon's tummy. Mm-hmm. It's not just you. We've got new Millilith recruits who can't even stand at attention without shaking. The force of an ancient god's presence seems to be too much for ordinary people to handle. I mean, I can't imagine Which is why. why we must stop that monster before it gets any closer to Liyue Harbor. So the Archon War was fought 2,000 years ago against enemies like that thing? No, that's scary. That's really scary. So will the power of the Chi-Sing, Millilith, and Adepti gathered here be enough to stop that god? We've already discussed this together, and our conclusion is... not necessarily. What? But all of you are supposed to be the guardians of Lila. Can't you think of something? One certainly could. Mm -hmm. Huh? The Chi-Sing did once research the matter of the Guizhong Ballista when it piqued their fancy. Oh. We're gonna use that thing? And as fate would have it, one who did craft the Guizhong Ballista with one's own hands is here. 
For what could you mortals ever learn of Adepti mechanisms? Who are you mortal? Yet, it would take one, but a little tinkering to turn this ballista into an engine of war beyond your wildest thoughts. Okay. <laughs> I suppose this is one blessing from the Adepti that we should be thankful for. Mm-hmm. So be it. We shall use the upgraded Guizhong Ballista to fight off that god. All the Adepti here can lend their strength to man it. Yay! We haven't a moment to spare. Our battle begins now! Alright, so what do we need yep. to do? Dang, she's powerful. <laughs> I just popped my hair clip. No. Yo. How the heck? Oh, she is powerful. So here we go. The three Obviously, we're going to be fighting. The Guizhong Ballista. Do not let the Fatui disturb their work. All able Millilith, with me. Let's go help too. We at Dutai have not faced a god in several millennia. Let one see what you are made of. Then, what strength remains within you? One <laughs> wishes to witness. Starfall looks like damage. Went too far. What is that? That is Osile's divine power. I am very familiar with it. Be careful not to get hit. Oh crap. How am I how am I supposed to dodge that? Starfall! Kupatui! Their attacks are unrelenting! How am I supposed How to dodge that? I'm gonna die. Snezhnai's diplomats will answer for this afterward. Every last one. <laughs> this moment will be frozen in time. Thanks for getting my attacks, man. The ancient gods attacking again! There are so many victory too! We can't uh, were you about to say we can't hold them, children? Huh? Oh. Yay! We're gonna get help. Don't lose heart. Here, take this. This is... Adeptal energy. That light from your body. It's like the time of Julian Cars. Wow! It's Madame Pink's shockwave. This granny is really strong. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. This is crazy. This is crazy. I'm so glad we have the teapot later. No slacking off! Of the 
Chilean, I guard you against evil. Cast your fear of Yay. injury by the wayside oh my gosh, this and is fight crazy. with all your might. I too did this during the Archon War. Huh. So this is what Ganya's like in a fight. My name means swiftness. Oh my gosh, Take this my is power so epic. And run as I do. I don't know. I don't see anymore. Oh, there they go. Child, you are strong in body and spirit. Perhaps you can withstand three forms of adeptal energy at once. This will hurt a little. Please bear with us. Once you've adapted, try to use them as that. Okay, okay. We can do this, we can do this. I'm sorry, I'm so quiet, guys. This is insane. How many more waves of this are there? Exercise caution! I fear that the god's power has reached its peak! In other words, if we hold here, there's nothing worse to come, right? Ooh, crap. No, it's okay, it's okay. so much there's so much going on so a second guys i need like just two seconds what the heck okay i'm back i'm going to give myself a little boost here let me see where are they where are they where are they where are the Fatui? Give me something. Oh, there, there are no more! Yo! She's powerful. The interlopers are no more. Now we may commit ourselves fully. Yay! Do it! Be careful now. 
The Guizhong Ballista is destroyed. Huh? Without its covering fire, retaliation shall be difficult. Okay. But the Jade Chamber is our last line of defense. We can't give another inch, no matter what. All right, what are we supposed to do? I have another idea. Okay. Uh, what do you mean, Lady Ningguang? This is amazing. I'll sacrifice the Jade Chamber. <gasps> what is the meaning of this? I understand. Traveler, lend me a hand. Farewell, old friend. Goodbye for now. Let us meet again in the future. Dang, guys, I love the 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 more expressive animation that was happening. Is it finally over? Hey, I will feed friend at the end of the stream. Thank you. The ominous aura of that monster has indeed begun to fade. The effects of the sigil of permission last but a short time. It will be some time before the overlord of the vortex can make any waves again. Good. We are indebted to you for your assistance. If the Adepti hadn't happened to be here, the future of Liyue Harbor would surely have been in great jeopardy. Mm -hmm. Save your flattery. We didn't just happen to be here. Surely you won't pretend to have forgotten the reason for which we came. Oh, please tell me that Rex Lapis returns. Come now. There's no need for such harsh words, Cloud Retainer. <laughs> Madam Ping. I've heard that when Ning Guang began learning to do business, she had already started setting aside part of her then limited income in preparation for building the Jade Chamber. Mm -hmm. At first, it was only the size of a small room, but with continued expansion, it has become the palace that lies before you now. I mean, it's kind of gone. It is a testament to Ning Guang's entire life, both as a businesswoman and as the backbone of the Liyue Qixing. Seeing the Jade Chamber destroyed in the defense mm -hmm. of Liyue means much to her. To me, such cooperation and sacrifice deserves at least some recognition, don't you agree? Madam Ping, thank you so much for that. Well... I was really hoping you would say that such sacrifice could at least be used as some <laughs> leverage in our negotiations. <laughs> Thank you all for hearing me out. We know very wow. well why the Adepti came here today. But please forgive us. We cannot yield to your wishes. Ningguang, you are a gracious negotiator. Oh? 3,700 years. According to our records, mm -hmm. the Adepti signed a contract with Rex Lapis to protect Liyue 3,700 years ago. Mm -hmm. Even to this very day, Liyue and its lands have stood the test of time, immovable as stone, just <laughs> as it was thousands of years before. This is truly no small feat. Yeah. Dang, Ningguan is, is but a that good does not negotiator. Mean that the Liyue of today is the same city as it was all those years ago. Do not merely cast your protective gaze upon mm -hmm. the land. Instead, focus your sights on our city <laughs> Welcome and back, each Hokey of the Chicken. citizens that dwell within it. Are you questioning our means of protecting Liyue? Hmm. I mean no offense. I simply hope that our Adepti forebearers would see Liyue in a new light. Mm -hmm. <laughs> forebearers, you say? One doubts you would be fit to be part of such a lineage. <laughs> this morning, Rex Lapis appeared to me in a dream. What? In the dream, I yearn to tell him that we Chi Sing, though mortal, are equally bound to the contract. 
Each passing generation of the Qixing leaves this many things of value to be inherited by the next generation. I also thought to tell him how the past generations of Qixing had strove under his rule to survive in our mortal world, establishing a network of contracts which has since come to be known as trade. But I dared not speak. I could only gaze at him in silence until the moment I awoke. Oh, Ningguang. Yet another perspective. What are you trying to say, Outlander? <laughs> right. That's something that happened in Mondstadt. It's a story about the Four Winds and the people of the Animal Archon. The Animal Archon sought to quell the strife between the two sides because he believed that such conflict would only scar the hearts of both and that nothing good would come of it. Mm -hmm. Each of the seven nations has its own scars oh from the past. Oh my gosh, Strike, you're crazy. <laughs> Though your point is the very height of simplicity, as Adepti, we've become a laughing stock <laughs> to be chastised thus by an outlander who has lent us such succor. All right, all right. Didn't Ning Wong suggest that we should focus on the city and each of its citizens? I apologize for appearing in full armor. I am afraid Feng I cannot Yen? show the proper courtesies. And who are you? I am Feng Yan, a sergeant of the Millilith. I have come to extend my thanks to the Adepti. Ooh. I thought this battle would perhaps be my last. But thanks to the aid of the Adepti, my forces were not as badly battered as I feared we might be. Larstack has casual. Thank you so much for the the raid. Hi raiders. We're just playing some Genshin. We just uh, defended Liwei against the the Lord of the Vortex, and so I'm like coming down from an emotional high. This is crazy. Although this is I intense. am a mere mortal soldier, I promise to hold the line and never betray the grace given welcome, to us welcome. by the illuminated Adepti this day. It's amazing. No, here's the thing. It's I thought that the that the um that the battles in Mondstadt were crazy enough. This is insane. There's nothing compared to this, and it went on for a while. It was really really good. <laughs> How did your stream go, by the way? What did you play? How'd you do? <laughs> Let me see. Huh? Why does everyone look so down? Oh. Didn't we just beat that big Chong -chong. monster? <laughs> Weren't you frightened, dear? It was quite the predicament. <laughs> I wasn't Sweet. afraid. All the strong Millilith guards were there, and those powerful heroes with their visions were there. She's Everyone so was sweet. there. Oh, that's adorable. Oh wait. Oh, nice. When danger is near, yeah, I just started playing a few weeks ago, so I'm loving this so much. Hey, thank you so much for the follow, Larsh. I appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome to the community. <laughs> Thanks for There's a Discord link there if you want it. Please come visit us for the next lantern right. Yay! Oh wait, that's right. There's lantern stuff. We wouldn't be able to participate. Huh? Yay! I'm very excited. I'm very excited. Seven years by Lucas Graham. I don't know that one, Kipengu. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. I don't know that one. My music because taste we is are limited. Adept -i. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. It must be hard being an adeptus. Mm -hmm. You see, this is what Liyue is like today. I'm sorry, today. Pangu. The country of contracts is grateful to the Adepti for their protection. But it is no longer necessary for the city to rely on the Adepti's power to solve every little niggling matter. Although their blood is weak, there is still <laughs> strength to be found in those we call mortals. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Strike, you know how it works. You know how it works. Just a second. Wait, um... There you go. The time of contracts between gods and Liyue has long since passed. Now is the time of contracts between Liyue and its people. 
Hmm. Seeing the port around us now, it is hard not to feel a bit out of place. <laughs> Wouldn't you say so, Cloud Retainer? Your line of inquiry is askew. One did not spearhead this expedition to Liyue Harbor. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Seems like the Adepti have had a change of heart. Oh, wait a second. I think I... I oh, just sing it. Uh, Strike, I think I gave you way too much time for the timeout. Wait just a second. I accidentally timed you out for 15, 50 minutes. I'm so sorry. I meant to just do five. I don't know how to remove it. No! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry, Strike. I'm so sorry. Oh no. <laughs> I feel bad now. I feel bad now. <laughs> oh no. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, the Adeptite of Attitude. Thank you! Okay, just a second. Timeout. Strike. Justice. 54. And then we do 300, not 3,000. There we go. Five minutes. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there we are, there we are. Um, Let us return now. Thank you, item. <laughs> All right. Eager to leave, conqueror of demons. <laughs> yes, one understands what the conqueror of demons means. The city of Liyue has changed much after our long separation. This is true. One fears that by the time one finally grasps the new contracts of Liyue, you humans would have once again changed the place beyond recognition. For people who are supposed to be protecting the city, you spent a long time away and not paying attention to it. Fair enough. Away we shall, and return whence we came. Hmm. <laughs> Since we Adepti have consensus, then one shall persist no further. All right. But how will we ensure that the Liyue Chising will not simply exploit their power once we depart? In my view, that is still a thing to be guarded against. This is true. <laughs> Ningguang, though. All right, I, I do tend to... you needn't worry. It seems Yay. to me that this right of supervision is best left to the people of Liyue. <sighs> All right. Looks like the that is the song that I know. An I was avoided. All swim it ends well, huh? <laughs> oh, right. It's nice that we've got peace and all, but we're forgetting one thing. What are we forgetting? Does it have to do with food or money? If so, keep it to yourself. The child wanted to unleash the god uh. so he could lure Rex Lapis out. But we were able to handle the Overlord of the Vortex on our own. So Rex Lapis never showed up. That's right. Oh, and speaking of that, don't we still need to get to the bottom of that Archon's death, too? Dive by Ed Sheeran? I don't know that one. Your point's your choice. <laughs> but isn't the strongest lead we have the Adeptilus right of parting that we're organizing? That's true. Perfect. I know that one. So yeah, I can I can sing perfect. Okay. Um, is there anything else here that I need to do? No. Okay. So I want to finish this stuff in Liyue. I didn't mean to do that. I'll keep this close. Oh, we've also got an adventure rank to claim. Uh. Go to the funeral parlor. We'll talk to Zhongli. Dancing time. Uh. 
Thanks for the ooh item. Just a second, I can't sing the song while I've got the game going in the background because the music doesn't stop. Um, wait a second. Fairy lady. Actually, wait, let me try something, let me try something. Um... Let me just do this real quick. Nope, that's not gonna work. It's it's fine. Just a second. I'll just wait. I've only got a few more minutes until I usually end. I wanna I wanna finish this. Is there anything I can do for you too? I'm Take me afraid to search. that no. funeral parlor isn't in the best state to receive guests. Where is Zhongli? to see Zhongli. Could you please tell him we're here? Unfortunately, Zhang Li isn't here at the moment. It seems he went to Northland Bank. Doesn't the Northland Bank belong to the Fatui? Last time we saw Zhang Li was before we went to the Golden House. Do you think he doesn't know about the attack on Liu? Ah, uh, he'd be Visiting pretty blind Fatui to miss it. At a time like this could only mean more trouble. We had better go and make sure that everything is okay. Okay, just one second, guys. Okay, you should have your mod back now, Strike. <laughs> I think we might need to make a rule that you can't time out mods uh, in this case. We might need to make that a rule. Because it does make a bit of a hassle. Oh my gosh. Going to the bank, we're going to the bank, we're going to the bank. Wait, it's below us now. Where is the bank? Where is the bank? Ah. Uh, there? Here. Wait, so it is still above us. Or is it here? Oh dang, I hate these. <laughs> Just climb over everything. Oh my gosh, straight. Alright, no, I don't want to talk to Vlad. You call this cooperation between Harbingers. Cooperation involves communication, you know. Oh. <laughs> Don't take it to heart, child. Besides, aren't you happy that you got to skip the formalities and bring chaos to the land? Very Tommy in it. I'm sure you must have enjoyed that. Wait a second, is that the woman who took our brother at the beginning? Oh, it seems that some no, of your it's friends not. have arrived. Zhang Li and Child! And... You! You're also one of the Harbingers? Senora. <laughs> it's you two. I believe we've met once before. Mm -hmm. In the city of Bards, was it? I'm glad you still remember my name. Ah, right. I imagine that it must have been rather hard to forget watching helplessly as something precious was snatched away from oh your friend. Gosh. Well... If it isn't you two, this is our first time seeing each other since Liyue was nearly wiped off the map. This is certainly a bit awkward, wouldn't you say? Uh, 
Okay. Hmm. Paimon knew that we should never have trusted a Fatui Harbinger. Oh, now don't say that. Sure, I may have misled you, but I never had anything against you personally. Besides, I thought we were getting along quite so well Jean together, didn't you? Except for that little top. Nothing personal. We just have different views, that's all. Of course, you may very well hold this against me, but that's up to you. The real deceivers here are Senora and Zhang Li. Curse them for leading me on. For li uh, what? So actually, I think. Stop wasting time, child. There'll be plenty of time to chat once I'm through here. You remember the agreement, Morax. Now, okay, strike, if you would okay. be so kind. The Gnosis, please. Wait a second. No, 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 no. Mo who did who who did she call Morax? Who did who did she call Morax? What in the world are you talking about? <sighs> Zhang Li is is Rex Lapis. Zhang Li is Morax. The contract is fulfilled. That which thou seeketh is now bestowed unto thee. For my promise is solid as stone. I never That came out of left field. You didn't tell me that he was the Archon. <sighs> How sanctimonious. What? So you're the Lord of Chiyo? No, wait. That's an exciting twist and all, but why give the Gnosis to the Fatui? I do not give it for free. I give it as agreed upon in the contract. For it is a matter solely between the Tsaritsa and I. Okay, we need to, we need to find this Tsaritsa. I have a feeling she's the one who took our brother. Yeah, you don't think you went a little bit too far with that whole fake death thing? Everyone was preparing the ceremony for you and splat! This big dragon falls out of the sky and all of Lyric goes into an uproar. Talk about a disaster. Gathering all the forces that had been bubbling behind the scenes, and then stirring them together in a pot that was bound to boil over. That's what he wanted to see, am I right? Wait, what? Perhaps it's best that I explain. As you know, I've dwelt upon this world for more than 6,000 years. It is now 3,700 years I mean, that ago explains that so I founded much. Liyue together with the Adepti. Even boulders that can withstand whirlpools will erode with the passing of time. I kept convincing myself that cracks had not begun to form, and that the end of my time had not yet come until one drizzly day. As I was strolling along the harbor, I heard a merchant tell one of his workers, You finished your duties. Go ahead and call it a day. I stood motionless among the crowds, asking myself... No! God! Oh my gosh, James. Have I already finished no, my God, duties? No, God, please, no! Oh, no! Please. No! But as I began to consider no! relinquishing my divine role, I soon discovered that many reasons still remained to not hastily depart. Was Liyue, the city I had dwelt in for so long, already prepared to enter its next age? This is amazing. I decided that a test was needed, in order to reveal the answer. So I feigned my own death and gathered the cast of Child, the Adepti, and the Liyue Chising to play their roles together on the stage that was Liyue. Indeed I was. The Gnosis, which I, I had like kept for so many years, like suddenly Morax. seemed Why? to have lost its meaning. That's right. Which is why I continued to safeguard the Gnosis until now. So you mean that if the Chaos ever reached the point of no return, you would simply appear and use your divine powers to bring Lila back under control? Of course. Yeah, and he it needs would have been freedom. all too easy for him, too. See, that's the thing about contracts, is that there's an end result. There's an exchange, and it has to end at some point. 
Just as a child quickly matures after losing their parents, so has Liu matured when faced with the death of its deity. In the end, the resolution to all that has transpired was even more satisfactory than I could have hoped for. Take the Adepti, for instance. Owing to their years of seclusion, they were the least informed. Yet when faced with a crisis, they commendably showed the greatest amount of restraint possible. Not only did they manage to cooperate with the Qixing, but in the end, they even made efforts to understand the hearts of the people. Yeah, that was Credit unexpected. Credit is also good. due to Signora, the emissary dispatched by the Cryo Archon to fulfill our contract. At my request, she kept everything she knew in strict confidence. This despite the eavesdropping ears of her colleague, <laughs> Child. Of course. This meant I could remain as Zhongli, even having the chance to fulfill the age-old traditions of Liu in this mortal form. Wow. All of these things turned out as I had planned. There is only one thing that I had not anticipated, and that was the conduct of the Liu Qixing. <laughs> I had expected them to do no more than the Adepti, to come to the defense of Liu. But when all was said and done, they seized the opportunity to supplant Liu as divine protectors, and used the subsequent <laughs> power vacuum left by my death to quickly gain complete control of Liu. Huh? That doesn't sound good at all! <laughs> On the contrary. Hey, thanks for the posture check. I there. think it is excellent. Check. I had always feared that it was too soon for them to take over from me. And the Hydra? And it was also that which I longed for the most. I mean, there's not much for me to say As here. Such, this is really This crazy. is the best parting gift anyone could have given this god of old. Hey, what about me? <laughs> Doesn't anyone feel the least bit of remorse for deceiving me? You've practically kept me in the dark! I mean, no, I don't think anyone feels remorse, child. <laughs> I think that thanks would be more appropriate. Mm -hmm. You certainly played no small part in all of this. Wreaking havoc and turning the city upside down. The Lord of Geo ought to thank you for your performance, if anything. If you hadn't created the pressure of a battle between mortals, a Depti, and a god, the lump of coal resting in the hands of the Geo Archon, Liu would never have been able to become a dazzling diamond of a city. <laughs> huh? Just whose side are you on, mocking me like that? <laughs> are you itching for a fight? Hey, haven't you learned the Liu saying, don't always call it as you see it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> well then. With the Gnosis in my possession, I have no use for such idle chatter. We should return to Zapolyarni Palace and seek an audience with Her Majesty, Saritza. Come, child. Ah, fine. I'll meet you there later. I'm not sharing a boat with the likes of you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Do as you wish. Well, child is salty. Now then. Is there anything else you wish to ask me? Um... Right! As Zhongli always told us, a good trade is a fair trade. Paimon has no idea what could be a good trade for a Gnosis. Yeah, it's literally the power of a god. Realistically speaking, there is no such thing. Huh? However, I am the god of contracts. For thousands of years, oh, I have Andrew made countless contracts. If the deal was of no benefit, then I certainly would not be inclined to agree to it. My agreement with the Cryo Archon will be the last of my contracts as the Geo Archon. My contract to end all contracts. As for the bargaining chip that the Tsaritsa used to balance the scales, Uncover that answer for yourself in your future journeys. I'm back. It's my mom just calling. I wonder what's going on. Wow. So. <laughs> Jongli. Morax. It's been real. Dang. So let's end this chapter, right? I still, I know, I haven't forgotten.
Okay. Today's the day of the rite of parting. Although the star of the show is fake, we spent so much time trying to organize it, it would be a real shame not to go there now. I still have to like process what that means. So Zhang Li was preparing a funeral for himself? Let's talk with this person here. Oh, well, since we're going through with this rite of parting, and I'm aware of that, that too, those James, rumors I hit the forgotten. nail on the head. Oh, so Rex Lapis is really. Wow. Oh. But they didn't catch the culprit, did they? Oh, come on. Do you think that the assassin could have been a normal person? You know what I think. <laughs> I don't think any of the gossip on the streets you hear from those shady types is worth anything. You're correct, Dajio. There's only but one Dajio? real possibility in my mind. I've heard that the assassin was that Fatui fellow. <laughs> Youngish, pretty high in rank. I think they called him child. I mean, let Fatui. people believe what they think. Hmm. They certainly are very suspicious. Who knows what those greedy, crooked folks... Lower your voice. If the Fatui catch you in their sights, Rex <laughs> Lapis won't be around to protect you this time. Wow. You know that god from the ocean couldn't have just shown up out of nowhere. I mean, it's been 2,000 years since Rex Lapis subdued it. Yes, <laughs> and to think that this happened right on the heels of the incident with Rex Lapis, too. Say... Do you think the person who assassinated our lord and released that evil god might have been one and the same? Now Everyone's that you mention it, that's child, very possible. Yes, it's... I mean, it all fits together. That mm -hmm. person must have colluded with the evil god to harm Rex Lapis. Still, what sort of supernatural prowess must this person possess to be able to do such things? That I have never heard impressive. of such a person in all my years. Ah, forget it. Guessing's no use to us. Look. The Millilith over there looks like he's about to make an announcement. Alright, let's see the Milli- Oh, stop. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Hear ye all! The Chi Sing's words. Though a dragon soars ageless as the mountains, it too must return to dust. Gods and Adepti live glorious lives. But both light and shadow have their season. So too must they face divinely appointed trials. Rumors and hearsay abound on the streets that Rex Lapis was murdered. Now, let the truth be revealed. Having been thwarted in his trial, Rex Lapis's soul has recouped the celestial heights. James the Love and Owen hey. He beseeches the people of Leo to, to grieve not and to let not their hearts be saddened. Underscore underscore beads. Hey, James, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you. No. Okay, just just one second. Just one second. Da 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 da. I mean, quickly. How do I? Um, here, I'm gonna, to I'm gonna... Street-born rumors, or indulge in baseless speculation. The problem is... It did work, it did work, James. Let me see. Okay, I'm gonna quickly... Run uh, through... Um, Daimon needs a translation on what the Chi Sing's announcement... I'm kind of just so flipping through this.
So that's a good one. I was just thinking as I was thinking, I need to either make um, a panel down below the stream that people can look at for a bunch of different songs that I can sing rather than just the command and chat or and or make a channel on Discord with songs that I know that I can just list in there if people want to hear them. <laughs> I'll be working on that. I'll be working on that, guys. In the meantime... Boom. Oh my gosh. Alright, Pangu, thanks for hanging around. Okay, let's go. Gameplay. We've only got a few more minutes, guys. We've only got a few more minutes. But I want to finish channel on Discord. Yeah. Yeah. I've only got a few more minutes, but I do want to try and get to the end of... Wait, what's this? Claim. Thank you for the uwu bano. Do 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 da da da. I got more new mail. Excuse me. Oh man, that must have just happened. Okay. Look, it's Ningguang and Kuching. Are they saying something? Are their speeches over? As said for previously. The alert, bano. Rex Lapis's soul returning to the heavens is the end of the contract. And it is also the end of an era. Here's the thing, though. The contract hasn't actually ended. Because it's been un ended under false... A false assumption. 3,700 years of contracts burnt and reduced to ash. We, the people of Liyue, were indeed prosperous. But blinded by our prosperity, we forgot that time can be pitiless. The long, unending dream of our Archon walking among us. Hmm. Now that we have awoken from our dream, we must learn to say farewell. Will you stand with us as we reestablish our contracts? As we build a new age of prosperity? Mm -hmm. So concludes wow. the words of Her Eminence, the Tianquan. Does Her Eminence, the Yuhang, have anything to add? Huh? Is she looking this way? Traveler. Yikes! She really is looking Ooh. our way! Okay. Is that the Traveler who they say defeated the ancient god? So young! The Liyue Qixing always repay their debts. And as you have heard, our eyes see far and our reach is long. Name your price. You deserve that much. What? Whoa. Uh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, Bono. Well, could you help me put up some missing person posters? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Always, always, always. Hey, let's write him on the Europe server. But who do I need to talk to? All of them. Why you? Uh -huh. Were you just trying to look cool earlier, or are you really that selfless? Oh my gosh. If you were looking for someone, you could have just told me that in private. <laughs> the cleanup of the premises, managing the crowds as they exit, making an account of the right. There's much that remains hey, to be done. Hey, Trailander, thank you so much for the first time chat and for stopping by. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, welcome. TikTok is a lot of fun. I'm glad. I'm glad people are are, are coming here a little bit from from the TikToks. It's really fun. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay, last person to talk to is Ningguang. Wizard, thank you so much for the raid. Hello, raiders. Oh my gosh, Zepediah, thank you so much for the first time chat too. Welcome, guys. I'm actually just kind of finishing up here. We, oh, James. James, was that was that really necessary? Oh my gosh! Yeah, we we fought the the Lord of Vortex today. Oh my gosh, is that Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Oh my gosh, how am I streaming this late? It's not terribly late for me. It's not terribly late for me. Okay, 
Groping you Time in zones was possibly the most masterful move we could have made. Mm -hmm. I believe that future generations will say so too when our deeds come up for their mm -hmm. review. Oh, by the way, how did your stream go? Did you, did you, like, what did you stream? How did it go? All right, so we've talked to all three now. I'm like, okay, when does the, when does the thing end? When do I get my Primo gems? When do I get my Primo gems? Please, come on, give me the things. <laughs> ah, yes, Morax himself. It is getting a little bit late, so I do need to... Playing Don't Starve, nice! Hey, Zhongli! Oh my gosh. Look at this. Everyone in Lila is caught up in their emotions, thinking that they'll never see Rex Lapis again. And here Enshin you is are wonderful. looking all relaxed. It's wonderful. <laughs> Why would I not feel more at ease after laying down the burden I, I have borne for 3,700 years? I get to kind of run around and just do kind of the side quests and things. You know, I'm so happy. Right. If Which I love the, side the two quests, of you totally can spare delicious. the time, I should treat you to a meal. At the Shinya kiosk. <laughs> Again. Ha! That sounds like big talk, Zhongli. Paima might have believed you if you were treating us to some third round knockout. <laughs> but you'd have to pay out your nose just to stand inside Shinya kiosk. Oh Are you sure god. you can afford it? Paimon, you're talking to a god. He's been feigning this mm. entire time. You're right. I do like the Mora. As the Rex Lapis Morax, oh my I can easily create more. Hey, we But since I have chosen to walk this earth as yes. the mortal Jean this is this is this should is abide by on. the same rules that mortals do. When I was journeying with you, though I still had the gnosis in hand, <laughs> I knew that I must soon retire from my role as an archon. <laughs> so I had to rehearse a little for my new life. Well, good to know. Oh no wonder! Paimon gets it now! You didn't look at the price tags when we were spending because you've never had to. Oh, that just makes sense. since you weren't used to not being able to just make more Mora as and when you wanted to, you had to try becoming a parasite to society who lives off of other people's credit. <laughs> That's incredibly blunt, but she's not wrong. Well, we were only spending for Tui money. <laughs> you don't have to say it like that. See, now that everything's cleared up, this makes so much more sense, and I'm not annoyed with him anymore. In the city of commerce, we do not merely exchange money or goods. <laughs> we also exchange knowledge, memories, and foresight, as well as positions, roles, and lives. This is true. The Archon Morax could never experience life as the true mortal Zhongli could. No matter how many times he descended <laughs> to be with his people. <laughs> I must thank you for that. Yay. I will treasure the memories that I made as Zhongli. Traveling the streets of Liyue with you. Oh, thank you, Zhongli. I appreciate that. That is true. But there is no journey that does not end. No meetings without partings. Are we saying goodbye? Hmm. Paimon thinks that we should make a move and continue our search for the Seven. I agree with Paimon. We have so much to do. I fear that continuing your journey may be difficult. The nation that neighbors Liyue by sea in Azuma is presently closed. Huh? Yes. The nation has been closed by order of its deity. Well, probably because of the things that happened here and in Mondstadt. The Electro Archon Ball. Baal. And just as the people as of Baal. Lira preferred to call me Rex Lapis, she too goes by another name among locals in Inazuma. Oh my gosh. Baal is someone that I've studied quite a bit, just because theology. Um, Hyman thinks we've heard that one before. Uh, Raiden. Ra Raiden? That is the case. And since Raiden is also the shogun of Inazuma, People call her the Raiden Shogun. Interesting. That said, though people at the wharf were saying that the situation in Inazuma is very tense, Paimon doesn't remember that always being the case. It wasn't that bad last year. Paimon's been there? Zhongli, since you're Rex Lapis, shouldn't you know something about what's happening there? Raiden. Just how did Inazuma <laughs> become a closed nation? James, I swear. 
Oh my gosh, what game are you stacking it's with? It's because of visions. Mm -hmm. Visions? When faced with circumstances beyond their control, humans often bemoan their lack of power. Mm -hmm. But if a person shows true strength of will at a desperate and fateful moment in their life, the gods will look upon them with favor. This is what visions are. Magical foci bestowed upon those who have been acknowledged by the gods. <laughs> uh-huh. That's how people in Tibet see it. Children of the Light. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I've heard about that. But starting from last year, Thank you for the, lurk, the Raiden Shogun began promulgating the Vision Hunt Decree. Wait, so the people in Inazuma are not allowed to have visions? Vision Hunt Decree? Yes. It was an order to seize all visions within Inazuma's borders and to inlay them upon the hands of the statue of the omnipresent god. I don't think I like that. They want to seize visions. I should think that in the Raiden Shogun's eyes, it is precisely because they are divine blessings that they should be under the sole dominion of divinity. That seems wrong, because they are divine blessings bestowed upon specific people for their use. Whoa, that's harsh. Don't like the that. The Animo Archon is the god of freedom, and the Geo Archon is the god of contracts. For her part, the Raiden Shogun is the god of eternity. Oh. It seems as though she has finally decided to eliminate any unstable elements that could pose a threat to her eternal realm. I mean, that does make sense if that is what she is the god of, but also, no. The fact that even I, the oldest of the seven, have now passed away will only strengthen her resolve to pursue eternity. Hey, thanks, Trail and Error. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hope to no see you hurt. sometime soon. She must have again quoted that adage she is most fond of when proclaiming that decree to her people. What did she say? Seven ideals for seven gods. And of these, eternity is nearest unto the heavenly principles. All right, then. Was there anything else you wished to know? Hmm. Let's see. What about child? As for Lily Oichi Singh, no, what? I kind of want to go through. <laughs> ah. That was a... that said, <laughs> the reason why the Chi Sing were so eager to resolve the incident and stop pursuing the... I hinted as much to the Adepti I as well. actually care too much. How did I accomplish that, you ask? Any of this? Hmm. Uh, have you ever heard of this particularly convenient... All right, oh then. Gosh. Was there anything else you wished... Yeah, about that. Before the Chi Sing made their announcement... These are indeed false accusations. But it remains undeniably <laughs> true that Child did send people to the Jade Chamber to prevent the Adepti and the Chi Sing from defeating the ancient god. I've heard right. that Ningguang is busy milking that for all its... Huh. <laughs> Those poor... Okay. Okay. All right, then. Was there anything else you wish to know? I'm just well, gonna go then. ahead and end this. Just... I suppose yeah, you'll have wonderful. to find a way to get inside this closed nation. Have... Okay. <sighs> so I need to spend some time between streams leveling up. It won't be this it won't be this Saturday, it won't be next stream that I do stuff. Ha! <sighs> 30 mora, a geo thingy, and then another thingy. Quickly. Let me come over here. Wonders of the world. Claim. Claim. Let's just scroll down, make sure I'm not missing anything else. Yikes. How much of a grind is this game? A lot, but it's really cool if you enjoy it. Okay, so I don't think that I need to do anything else because we have completed the thingy. Dang. Okay, I'll do this off. I will do this off stream. It's okay. Um, let me do just a couple more things before we end stream. One of them is this. Activate. Core meltdown. <laughs> yeah, I can. Off stream. I do a lot of grinding off stream in this game because I just love it so much. It's really, really fun. I've already done this. Exploding population. Oh! So I can fish once I do this. 
Okay, so I will do that. That's something that I'll probably end stream and immediately do because I really want to fish. I want to fish in this game. Um, let me quickly go over here. Make sure there's nothing else. Unexpected guest. Complete other quests. Gotta do this. Gotta do that. Gotta do that. Dang, I've got so much to do. I've got so much to do. I will save the Archon quests until when next we meet, guys. Um, dang. This is amazing. This game so much. All right, give me just one moment. We need to, um, boom, that right there. Now, I'm gonna close out of Genshin because I don't want to lag my computer down too much. So let me look at this real quick. Confirm, and I'll get back on in just a minute. It's pretty rewarding with Paimon. Nice. Okay, good. Good to know. Um, give me just one second because we sang the song. We've got to feed a friend, and I will add the slime rancher. The slime rancher thing. Oh, Bono, thank you for deeming him attendance. I didn't actually recognize that, although I saw that you were here. Okay, um, we've got to get into Minecraft. And a little reminder, I'm going to open Minecraft and my computer is going to just kind of lag a little bit for just one second. So if stream goes all glitchy, don't worry. It'll come right back in just about 10 seconds. So give me a moment. Un momento. Yeah. Yay. Thank you again for the raid, Wiz. It's awesome. It's awesome. La da 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 Okay, Wiz, we need to hang out sometime like off stream because I know we've like talked once in a VC before for like thirty seconds. Like thirty seconds. And we seriously just I, we need to fix that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh, it's the end of stream, which means, guys, 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 there's one last thing that we need to we need to do something, and it is this. Wait till stream comes back up. Just a second. Because it is the end of stream, we do a fun little thing where I turn on a specific song, guys. And that song is this one right here. Because I love you guys. Okay, let me quickly switch back over. Transitioning. Boom. All right. So here we go. We're going to go into single player. We're going to the amp survival world. Try to keep yourself busy. I have been busy as well lately, so we'll figure something out. We'll figure something out. Oh my gosh. We got, I believe it was three new followers during stream today. Guys, that's not, that's not bad at all. You guys are awesome. I am so, I seriously appreciate every new follow, follow everything, everyone in chat is just wonderful. So let me go down here. And I saw you on my fortune cookie, what a great gift, like a basket of cookies. There we go, we got a friend, we got a friend. Oop. We're gonna pop up here. A. We're gonna take the book. Now we're going to flip to page 35. I think we might be getting into page 36 today. I think. Ooh, Ooh yeah. Page 36. Okay, so here we go. Today during stream, the end, the end of last stream, we had Shadow Core. And then today we had um, Zeno. He, wait. Zeno. TTV. And then after that, we had Larch. That. That casual, and then after that we had um, Zepe Day uh, 25. So thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone who followed, everyone who was in chat today. This has been an absolutely awesome, awesome stream today. I absolutely love streaming with Genshin. I know I've been probably streaming it a little too much lately, but you know what? I can't help it. I can't help it. It's such a good game. It's such a good game. Okay, so uh, this Saturday I did say that I would be playing, um, I would be playing, what's it called? Minecraft. Instead of, instead of Genshin, instead of anything else. So I will go ahead and be doing that. I will be doing that. And don't, not sure if I'll be on the server or if I'll be on something else. But yeah, we'll be having fun. We'll be having fun. It'll be great. It'll be great. 
And so, yeah, thank you again, guys. Thank you so much for being here today. Uh, don't forget, in um, if we if we reach 30 subs by the end of the month, um, you guys already hit you guys already hit the the, the, the one with the where I'm gonna have a VTuber. I'm gonna have a VTuber next month during October. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be a great time. It's gonna be, gonna be a lot of fun. So yeah. So that one's already done. But if we hit 30 by the end of next uh, the end of this month, we are going to be doing a uh, some new emotes as well. So that's there. That one's right there. And then at the beginning of next month, guys. I have an absolutely fantastic, super exciting sub, sub goal for you guys. You guys have no idea. It is going to be amazing. It's the first time on the channel. You guys are going to enjoy it so much. So please, 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 just, just, just plan ahead. My first stream during October. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. So you guys have an awesome evening. I love you all so much. Please stay safe and stay kind. Take care of yourselves, guys. Give me just a moment to see who I can raid, and I'm going to just sign off for the night. Goodbye! I'm going to send you guys over to... Oh my gosh, I never... There's, who, who is streaming today? Because it's only showing me the top... The, the the top five streamers that I follow and and that and it's the top one is Pokimane and the bottom one is Captain Sparkles so you can guess who everyone is in between but um I'm gonna guy I'm gonna send you guys over to um to spend some time with Artie they're playing Dead by Daylight and I know that there are plenty of people on the channel who like Dead by Daylight so you guys have fun over there bye guys and see ya.